Hi Spartan, welcome in. You better behave though today. You cannot afford to get timed out during the peace lock finale. get some yos hello it's been a hot minute since we've seen you you better not miss the finale ryan i'm gonna be very upset if you can't watch today i'll say it right now call it'll work do it no i'm kidding don't Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Man, I'm so nervous. My hands are shaking. <laughs> I'm so nervous. I've been stalling the finale for so long. You guys know. Estoy nerviosa. Porque... Elite Four? <laughs> As. Como se dice scary? Peligroso is dangerous. Extraño is strange. I forgot. Does somebody know how to say scary? I know it's on the tip of my tongue. should be done by now. Guys, face cam on in one minute? I'm not even kidding. Any direct translation for scary? Really? There's gotta be a word. I only know peligroso, but that's like dangerous. Okay, three, two, one. Hello. Guys, get your suits on. It's a serious stream today. Hello, welcome in. It is 11.05 a.m. right on time on Tuesday. Yeah, it's Tuesday. Tuesday, July 7th. <laughs> Why am I looking at the numbers? It is Tuesday, July 30th. I keep on seeing the 7th of July. And we had Tooth, Ryan, and Spartan in the starting soon screen. Welcome in, guys. I'm nervous. I'm not shaking as much anymore. I don't got tremors. I'm very scary. Oh, miedo! Tango miedo is how do you say it? I'm scared. Oh, 
I knew it. I don't know the adjective for scary, though. Okay. Guys? Serious turn today? Get your best suits on. Also, you can actually see the chrome on the suit now. And also, look at my hair today. It's so nice. Okay. The plan is simple. We're beating the fucking- No, I swore! Okay, it wasn't the first five minutes. We're good. We're not demonetized. Okay. <laughs> we're gonna beat the Elite Four today. That is the plan. That's all we're doing today. Because surely... Surely, it won't take more than an hour. Because the Elite Four, there are... Obviously, four gym battles. But I don't know if there's a rival battle before or after. No spoilers! But I assume it's just the Elite Four, but I am kind of scared of if the, I have to face, like... Oh wait, I know there's a champion at the end, so wait, fuck, it's five battles. Okay, so... I'm so nervous, I'm knocking shit down, okay. I know I said at the very start of the Peace Lock run, if we get to the Elite Four and I die, we're resetting. I'm gonna say screw it, and I'm gonna say this again when we do our YouTube intro. I'm not doing that shit. We're gonna save right before we walk in, and if I die, I'll death for it. I don't even care. I don't even care. I just wanna beat this stupid shit. Save scamming for the win. Honestly, I don't care. It's been five months. It's been five months of Pokemon. I mean, I've only been doing it every other week for five months. It's gonna be so embarrassing. Because it's gonna be so embarrassing when I when I like take a screenshot, thumbs up, all happy, and then looking at the live split. Fucking a hundred plus hours. So yeah. Also, I got something to show chat. No narcs, but I didn't. I don't see these people in chat right now. You know how we said on Friday for the art lunch they get exclusive hollows? They finally dried, so I can mail them tonight or tomorrow. Ooh, look at that. It's more noticeable on the flower because it's colored in. Look at that. And then the rose. Wow, look at that, the hollow. Hi, Ethan. Full KO time? Shut the fuck up! I'm going to flip my shit if I lose. Guys, get your suits on. Also, the suit almost fits me now. I'm down like 13 pounds. No, more than 13 pounds for the year. W. I'm down 15 pounds for the year. I gotta lose five more to hit my goal. But this almost fits now. I would die. I'll just ban you forever. Okay, are we, let her, are we ready for our intro? Man, I don't want to do this shit. Oh wait, before we start stream, guys, gentle reminder, I am doing the subathon starting on Thursday at 10 a.m. PST, so normal stream time. Oilers, politely hold. Hold for Thursday. It's a 30-hour cap, and we did talk about it on stream yesterday. And if you have any further ideas, um, there's a post on my Twitter. Oh, also, if one of the activities we're going to be doing is ink portraits, so if you want me to draw you on stream, there's a separate Twitter post that you uh, reply with a picture of yourself to. Do that tonight, because I need to sketch them tomorrow. Okay. As always, guys, today's stream is presented to you by... Peace and Art on MyShopify.com Oh my god, look at this! The new Lionel prints are available, and like I said, there's a 1 in 10 chance of you getting a holo. Holy moly, guys. Click the link in chat, go bookmark the website. I'm going to try and have new drops every month. You know... And also, if you're a current subscriber, you get $17 off one time only. Ain't no way! Did you know the 17th entry in the Pokedex is Pidgeotto? That's unfortunate, because 17 is my favorite number, but, like... I'll say it, Pidgeotto kind of lame. Okay. Stop the music. You guys know the drill. YouTube intro. Okay. You know the drill. Say hi, YouTube. Are they prints or originals? They are stamp and lino prints. So I carve the stamp and then I hand print them with embossing powder so it's raised. And then they're colored in and you have a 10% chance of getting a hollow. If you want more information, you can check out the listing. Okay, you guys ready? Say hi, YouTube. You know the drill. Wait. Oh, yeah, it's day three of the piece. Technically, like, day 26 or some shit. Okay. 
Got to make sure we're camera ready. It is day 23 of the Peace Lock 2024. It has been over five months of doing this run on stream. Right now we're at 128 hours, and it's finally time to face the Elite Four. On day 22, we finished leveling up my Elite Four team. So today we're going to be buying items to level up and increase the defense or attack of my Pokemon that I like. And then finally facing the Elite Four. I did say this at the start. I know I said that if we reset at the Elite Four, we start at the beginning. But that is not happening today. Today, I've decided, I've made the executive decision. If I lose all my Pokemon in the Elite Four, I'm resetting. I do not care. And by reset, I mean Alt F4ing and just trying again from a save point. I am not going to spend another 100 hours in this stupid game. I know I like Pokemon Emerald, but honestly, screw it. We're not doing this. That is the plan. Also, you can still gift subs and make me lose my Pokemon. It's 11-11. Oh my god, make a wish! Hi, Kim. Can we get some yos? Hello. Okay, stop saying... This is for the YouTube edit. Guys, stop saying bad words. Guys. Okay. I wish Peace loses at the Elite Four. I'm not even kidding. If I beat this without losing any Pokemon, you're getting perma-ban, Ethan. <laughs> My last message when it happens. Yeah, you know what sucks? When people watch the VOD, they can't see the pin chat. I think one of my favorite new joke metas is like some like a mod pinning a chat and then the chat is being like Keck L pinned. It's so funny. Uh guys just be funny and then I'll ping your message maybe. Just a gentle reminder. Oh my god, I'm shaking. Just a gentle reminder for those watching live. Please don't tell me what to do. I, if I throw, I throw. If I win, I win. But please don't tell me how to play. Don't tell me what moves to do unless I very, very, very explicitly ask. Remember, this is a blind playthrough. Um, Vaxi Gaming, I'll time you out for an hour. I'm not even kidding. Okay, are we ready? Oh my god, I'm so nervous. I'm genuinely so nervous. I feel like I'm gonna throw up, but like, of happiness, cause like, if, if this is finally the end, this is the end. Okay, right now, we are 7 subs away from releasing a Pokemon, 14, po to 14 total Pokemon missing, and 3 resets. Hopefully, I do not have to reset. <clears throat> I am willing to make a handshake deal. If I ha if I like Alt F4, for every time I Alt F4 today, I'll give chat a sub. I think that's fair. Because that is like a... That is a last minute rule. I just genuinely... I, I need... I physically need to beat this today. Do you still have to release Pokemon you lose? I mean, if it's the Elite Four, and I lose them all, then I'll just Alt F4. But like, if we get through the Elite Four, and I lose two, then yeah, we'd release them after. But I'll be honest, I'm not going to play this after I beat the Elite Four. We're not doing a 100% dex run. We're not. What's a full dex Nuzlocke? Uh, no, it's just if my party dies, I die in game. Okay. Dude, I legit, my stomach hurts so much. I'm so nervous. Do a 100% shiny run? No, guys, that's not happening. I know you guys want Pokemon, but it's not. Okay, get your suits on. It's gaming time. Holy moly, I am so nervous. 103 hours Omega Dance. <laughs> okay. We're in. What if you open this today and your roommates deleted your save file? Literally, they don't have access to my computer, and anytime I leave my room, I turn my computer off. Because I believe in social security. I know, I mean, like, not social security. Obviously, I believe in that, but, like, 
Tech security? I don't know. I I'm so nervous, guys. <laughs> okay, be honest. Do you think I can do this? Be completely honest. Type one. Okay, looking at my party, everybody is too level because the Elite Four is level... F the Elite Four? The gym leaders are 46 to 58. So right now, Magikarp, Ralph, Blaziken are maxed out. Manny is one level away from Max, Gavin is 55, Blossom is 55. I'm still deciding, like, what items to give to each Pokemon. You can do this, thank you, Ryan, thank you. So, so we don't have to go through the, the victory road. What we're going to do is we're going to teleport to the mall. Oh yeah, I'm not inside the building. Okay, we're gonna teleport, and then when we get to the mall, we're gonna see which Pokemon have lower defense, and then we might buy defense items for them. How much money for you to catch a Ditto and name it Tooth? Um, we'd have to find a Ditto. Are, are Dittos even in this game? We didn't see any. Evergrande City. Oh, wait, I need a Pokemon that can fly. Oh, yeah, because I healed last there. Okay, so what we need to do... Is we need to get a Pokemon that can fly. And then fly to the mall Pokemon Center. But keep Ralph in our party, that way we can teleport back to Evergrande City. Wait, that's a spoiler? <laughs> okay, I, I didn't see it. You're good. The one time I didn't reach it. I reach out all the time, don't worry. Dude, I'm, I'm so nervous. You can fly to Evergrande? But then it, it, it flies me to like the beginning of Victory Road and that's annoying. Because I already tried flying and it teleported- or it flew me to the start. <sighs> Put the cursor on the top half of the dot on the map? Wait, what? We'll figure it out later. Lily Go City. I'm so nervous. I can't do this shit. so excited for me to win, right? Right? I mean, I think I can do it first try, but, like, I'm still really nervous. Because the things that always trip me up in the gym battles is when a Pokemon is a two-typer, which is majority of my team right now, anyway. But I still get really scared, because... If they have a move that I don't know they have, and it's a weakness, I'm cooked. Second floor. Also, in terms of save points, I'm not gonna save before we go in. Because if I do have to try again, I might want to try a different item build. Healing items. We'll see those later. I want to buy, like, the defense ups. Potions. Imagine if I buy a revive. Okay, so, second floor... ...is heals and potions. X speed raises the speed. As long as I'm a higher level, I think it should typically be higher speed. X special, X attack. X defend, dire hit, 
guard spec X accuracy. So I think I want to invest money into defense. So X defend, I need to write this down. X defend is 550, but it's a held item. Race is the base attack, base special attack, base defense, special defense, speed, HP up. Right now I have $400,000. to give all my Pokemon Citrus Berries or X Defense. Because it seems like the iron, it doesn't raise the stat by much. So I think if I want to raise defense, it's probably best if I give everybody X Defense because it's cheaper. I don't know who's in the Elite Four. Like, I know their names, but I don't know what Pokemon they have. Because this is blind for the first attempt. Yes, the X items will disappear once they're used. So if the Pokemon goes into battle, they will lose it. So, I'm still... Okay. I'm asking for chat's opinion on this. We'll do a poll. Citrus Berries as an held item? Or X Defense? Because I genuinely don't know how much the X Defense, like, increase it by. Where's the neither option? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Guys, go vote. What should I do? Should I use X Defense or Citrus Berries? Because the Citrus Berries will heal 30, and it uses automatically, so it saves a turn. But the X Defend hopefully would increase... Yeah, X defense are held items. I don't know. Go vote, go vote now. Okay. We had one person vote for X defense. Dude, I feel like a frog in my throat. <laughs> I'm so nervous. Okay. But the problem is, X defends, like, expire whenever the Pokemon ends the battle. So if I do the X defend strat, I would have to buy, like, there's five battles, I have six Pokemon, I'd have to buy 30. And that's if, like, I put every single Pokemon into battle. I would just have to remember to, like, re queue it. Okay. <laughs> I didn't see the poll. Good one, guys. Good one. Because I think raising the base, like, defense with protein, it costs 10,000 each. So that means I could buy... Wait, I could buy 40 proteins. Already, let me check my normal, like, healing inventory items. Yeah, I have 22 antidotes. I have 19 full heals. Wow, I have a lot. Should I buy some more? <laughs> 10 ice heals. 5 elixirs, but I have a bunch of lapa berries. 15 burn heals. 18 hyper potions. 10 awakenings.
15 paralyzed heals, 6 max potions. Two super potions. I already have six X attacks. Next items don't get consumed when held, they have to be used from the bag. Oh, yeah, because the Pokemon doesn't know how to use it. Oh yeah, so that I would miss a turn then. I forgot about that. They only know how to use berries. Oh yeah, somebody told me that like a week ago too, I think. Okay. So maybe the X defend is not a strat. Okay, first I need to see what my actual defense stats are for my Pokemon. I think I will go with the Citrus Berry strat. Because I don't want to waste a turn to use an X-Defend. So... Gyarados... 135 regular defense... 136 special defense. Hi, Alex. Welcome in. Can we get some yos? Hello. Gardevoir has 101, 152 special defense. So, I'm asking the gamers. The difference between regular defense and special defense means if somebody does a physical move on Ralph, it would be more effective than a special move, because Ralph has higher special defense, is that correct? Dude, I'm literally shaking in my seat, I'm so nervous. Kind of like you said. Okay. So I was kind of right. <laughs> Why is Blaziken kind of- First Jab was thirsting over Mighty N and not Blaziken. I swear everybody's a F-U-R-R-Y. Okay, Manectric does not have a lot of special defense. Neither does Graveler. Okay. <laughs> what are you guys talking about? <laughs> moves like Bite would be protected by normal defense. There are special moves which are normally moves it seemed like magic power. Special defense, defense against that. Okay. So special defense is strength against special time moves. Regular defense is strength against regular physical moves. Okay. I was right. So right now, Pokemon with the lowest regular defense is 101 with Gardevoir. And the Pokemon with the lowest special defense is Manectric with 72. So let's see. I also kind of want to see attack. Okay, I, th I don't think I want to increase my Pokemon's attack. They're all pretty like leveled up anyway. So it raises the base attack, special attack, base defense, and special defense. Raises the base HP of one Pokemon. 
Okay. Since Gardevoir has the lowest regular defense, I'll buy one iron to see how much it does. Ooh, minus 10k. I have to do it from the bag, I forgot. It won't have any effect? What? What? Oh, give. Okay, you- okay. I did the wrong thing. Is it really used? It's saying it won't have an effect. Wait, what? Because it's maxed out? Okay. Okay, okay. Because you already have the max? Okay, so I will highlight which ones have max already. So allegedly Gardevoir has max base defense. So let's try it against my second lowest, which was Blossom. Okay, now let's see how much it raised it by and see if this is all worth it. So Belasso's base defense stat was 109. It's now 110. It only goes up by one? Bro, is it worth it? Is it worth it? This is Pokemon Emerald. Is it even worth it? Well, I have like $400,000. I don't think there's anything else I would use my money on anyway. I'll buy three. I'll buy three of each of these. Let's see, can I use it on Gyarados? Gyarados is 135. Maybe Manectric? Okay, Manectric is maxed out for regular base defense. I'm looking at who is the lowest. Blaziken is the next lowest. Okay, Blaziken's physical defense is also maxed. You could say Manetric is pretty electric. Next lowest is Blossom, but I don't think we'll use Blossom in battle. Okay, Magikarp is also maxed out. Don't tell me I bought these and I can't even use them. Okay, Gavin is also maxed out. That means the only Pokemon that can use the iron is Blossom. We'll see you tomorrow, Spartan. I gave you many warnings. Next time will be a fucking ban. I'm not even kidding. Okay. 
So the only defense I can keep raising is Blossom, and since I bought it, why not? I can't use it on any of my other Pokemon. His Zinc is special defense. Let's see if we can use this on anybody. Right now, lowest special defense is Manectric. Manectric is maxed out. Graveler has the next lowest with 63. Graveler's special defense is maxed. And then Blaziken. Blaziken is also maxed. I want to level up Blossom absolutely best. Gardevoir is maxed. Well, at least I don't, I don't have to spend a lot of money on the proteins. Gyarados is also maxed. So that means the only Pokemon that I can increase their base stats for defense is Blossom. Might as well, because nobody else can. Okay, well... There goes my big plan. So now... Yeah, stats only went one point up per protein bot. Or per drug bot. So what else can I really do? I have so much money! Should I buy a bunch of HP ups? Why not? Let's see everybody's base HP. 202, 168, 189, 184, 162, 184. Let's buy some HP ups. Let's buy five. So, if I can increase their HP, I'll just do Gardevoir first, because I feel like Ralph will be my most versatile Pokemon. Okay, Ralph is maxed out. W. Graveler only has 162. Graveler is maxed out. Manectric is maxed out. Everybody's maxed out! Dude! Uh... Blossom is maxed out? Okay, I bought these. Waste. Absolute waste. Everybody's maxed out! Okay, so everybody has max HP. Bro. Am I, like, overleveled? <laughs> okay, so... I'll buy one protein and one calcium to see if I can use on anybody. I wouldn't see you're overleveled. I mean, some of my Pokemon are at level cap, so. Ralph is maxed protein. Oh wait, that's because Ralph is a special attacker. Magikarp is also maxed. So is Blaziken. Okay, my whole strat was just to buy a boatload of proteins and powders, but I guess not. 
I think you can give them a sum total of vitamins. That means if you filled up their defense, you can't give them any other kind of vitamins. Oh. But some of my Pokemon didn't take any vitamins. They didn't get zooted. Okay, Gavit is maxed. <laughs> Yeah, I guess Blossom is my weakest link. Everybody else is maxed. And the whole point of using Blossom is so I can, like, poison or put Pokemon to sleep. Yeah, Blossom is the only one who can take any of my vitamins. We'll just give him out a- oh, Blossom is maxed out too. Dude, I wasted 50k! Okay, well, my Pokemon's base stats are maxed. So I assume if my Pokemon's base stats are maxed out, then I genuinely don't know how much like an X-Defend would help. But I'll buy some. I'll buy ten. If you're gonna do resets, you might as well try it. That's- yeah, that's the plan. I'm not like- I'm not like too locked in about it. Like if I throw, I throw. We'll just reload the save and go from there. Okay, so I have all my base stats as high as they can be, basically. I don't know if I would choose to use the X Defend in battle, but you know, I still want to have some. Oh yeah, I was gonna see TMs because I wanted to teach Gyarados Ice. Because there will be, for sure, a Dragon Boss. A brutal snow and wind attack that may freeze the foe. Only 5k, let's buy it. I'm rich. I think I do already have an ice TM. Okay. Let's see. What do I got? Water pulse, calm mind. Ice beam. Power 95, accuracy 100, only 10 PP. <laughs> only 10. <laughs> okay, Ice Beam, Blizzard, a brutal snow and wind attack that may freeze. Accuracy 70, 120. Okay, honestly, I'll probably go with Ice Beam. Because, you know, I love 100% accuracy. The more the user likes you, like Flirt. Shadow Ball Ghost type. Ghost would be effective against Psychic. But Gyarados still has a Dark type move. Don't tell me. I can't remember if grass is effective or not against flying. Because I don't have any Pokemon that are strong against flying, I don't think. Oh, no, 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 no. Gravel has a rock type move. But then ground... Yeah, ground is weak against flying, but gravel does has, has a rock move. Uh, don't tell me what other move is effective against flying. I, I know electric is. Wait, electric is! That's why I have Manectric on the team. I forgot. Okay, we're good. We're gonna. I think my team is pretty solid against most every Pokemon. 
So I think I want to teach Ice Beam to Gyarados. Okay, Surf, Water Type, Accuracy 100, Dragon Dance, Bite, and Twister. Ooh. I genuinely have no idea what Pokemon is weak against Dragon Type. But I'll be honest, Dragon Dance I probably won't use. I like just going full offensive, typically. I like Twister because it can attack two foes. Like, if I have two opponents, it'll hit them both. drive bro you know what the stream could go for nine hours <laughs> but hi alien welcome in can we get some yo's hello i'm swapping out dragon dance screw it if is this is the wrong decision we'll just reset Next floor is just decorations, but since the ice beam only has 10 PP, we're gonna increase, we're gonna buy the item that increases it. I think it was on the third floor. not buy the PP up? I think that was only a found item. Yeah, I don't think I can buy it. Uh, that's fine. I have Lepa Berries. Okay, I'm gonna be a hack. Making sure I have at least 20 of every item. Why not? You know, I'm loaded. I'm stacked. I got bands on bands. <laughs> Imagine buying 99. won't use the potions but who knows I might need it I have 32 supers I don't need more and let's, let's buy a lot of hyper I'm like over preparing but I'm so scared I'm so scared I mean it's so nice having money Okay, I think that's all that I can buy. Twenty-two antidotes, twenty-one full heals, five elixirs, twenty ice heals, twenty burn heals, three max ethers, twenty-four hyper potions, twenty awakenings, five energy powders, two lava cookies, twenty paralyzed, twenty max potions, 
three fresh water, max elixir, three, ten full restores, 32 super potions, six X attacks, 10 X defense, 20 potions. Okay, I should be fine. I, <laughs> I should be fine. Surely. Okay, I think I'm ready. I think I'm ready. Oh, it's because I used the computer, didn't I? Dang it. That's annoying. Palomar! Okay, you guys said if I queue here. Oh, before it didn't let me fly here. It didn't let me. W. Okay. Let's see. I think what I'll do is since I still have like 200,000 left, I'll just make a save here. Because I've already increased my Pokemon to the max stats they're able to. And have a whole lot of items, so... Let's give everybody a Citrus Berry and then make a save point here. While I'm doing this, I'll do a prediction. it for two minutes no five minutes guys go gamba do you think i will beat the elite four on my first try the strat is going to be giving everybody a citrus berry that way they auto heal okay the only reason why i'm taking away the citrus berry is to make sure that like I don't, like, look over it. I think it's better to give them citrus berries, because if they get poisoned, hopefully it would heal if they do go less than 50% damage. Wait, what? The citrus berry was taken and replaced with the citrus berry. Lol, 19k doubters. Is it you? Look at me, I'm in my finest. There's no way I can lose. Gavin is holding XP share. Will I switch? Yes. Really? My bag is full. Really? Really? Five PP ups. I lied. Okay, we'll do that to the ice beam. I forgot. You know what? I really hope I win the first try. Because we really need some inflation in the peace in chat room. <laughs>
Who is believing? I think I can do this. I do think I can. And like, I'm allowed to use items between battles. So I think I should be fine. Okay, PP up. We're gonna give this to Magikarp for Ice Beam. Okay, Ice Beam is maxed out. Let's see who else I can give this to. I should probably swap out Rao's teleport for something else because I don't really need it. Let's take a look at that, actually. Because the only reason why I get teleported is so... is because I didn't have somebody who would fly, but now I do. Ooh, Water Pulse? Power 160. And it may confuse? I think Surf is stronger, though. Ralph? Ooh, I can! But what would a ghost move be effective against? It'd only be effective against Psychic. And then I have... Oh wait, that could be interesting because if somebody has a Psychic build, I would have to use Magikarp because they're the only Pokemon that has dark moves. But then if Magikarp tragically dies... They could put in Ralph and they can use a ghost move. Maybe, I'll think about that. Rest might be good as well. I could maybe try Attract. Because Ralph already has the copy ability. Okay, I think what I'll do... So now that all my Pokemon, Pokemon are maxed out, also everybody has a Citrus Barrier, I'll make a save point here. That way if I do have to reset, we'll reset here. And then what I'll do is I'll give Ralph Shadow Ball and we'll see if that strat works. Yeah, 100% accuracy. I love that. Ralph now knows Shadow Ball. There we go. Okay. I think I'm ready now. Also, guys, I'm really sorry, but I have to run an ad. That took an hour to prep. But we're an hour into stream, so if you want to avoid that ad, all you gotta do is subscribe for $5.99 to $6. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long, or you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. We'll wait three minutes before I actually go in. That way people don't miss a single second. But yeah. Okay. I should be fine. Okay. I need some water.
I'm looking at the prediction. Only 5% believe. I want to see who doubted. I really want to know. Alex? You doubted with 19,000? You are so mean. That is so mean. Yeah, I don't casually play Pokemon. I don't. Not <laughs> PSA2 lol, classic. You, <laughs> you spent all this time lurking, saving your points? I really hope you lose them all. I really do. Call me, like, a hater, but I really hope you do. <sighs> She's only a pro player? Wait, that's so real. Okay, we'll wait one more minute. Guys, be completely honest. Am I, like, ready? Did I do good? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, VOD watchers, just skip an hour. I'm so scared. Okay. I'm ready. Editor, cut here. All my Pokemon are maxed out. All their stats are at max. Magikarp, Ralph, Blaziken are at level cap, which is 58. Manectric, 57. Graveler, 55. And Blossom, 55. All my Pokemon are holding a Citrus Berry. That way I can save a turn in healing. And also, if they have a status move like burn or poison, hopefully the citrus berry will save them. But it is finally time. 129 hours. Technically, only 100 hours for the save. Or 103 or 104 for the save, because I lost my original save, which was honestly a huge L. But it is finally time. For the end. Please don't tell me there's like trainer battles in between. Wait, this is so sick and futuristic. No turning back? Wait, is that real? No, let me out! No, no, no! <laughs> let me out! Okay. We're going in! We're going in! Hello, sir. Can I just walk around you? No. Okay. <laughs> okay. Welcome, Challenger. I'm Sydney of the Elite Four. I like that look you're giving me. Oh my god, he's flirting. Ew. Is he using Twitch whispers? I guess you'll give me a good match. That's good. Looking <laughs> real good. Oh my god, I don't even want to say this. All right, you and me. Let's enjoy a battle that can only be staged here in the Pokemon League. Okay, there's no indication of what the typing is. My heart is pounding. Wait, this is a cool background. Elite Four Sydney would like to battle. He has five Pokemon. Elite Four Sydney sent out Mightyena, level 46. Mightyena should have the Intimidate. Yes, but so do I. Okay, a level 46? I could swap out to Blaziken. I think Mightyena only has normal and dark type moves. Switching to Blaziken. I thought by the look of this guy, he was gonna have fighting type Pokemon. Okay, sand attack just rollers my accuracy, but that's fine. Uh, double kick, easy. Yo! Look at that! Easy! Even though I'm like 12 levels above. Easy! Elite Force Sydney is about to use Shift Tree. Shift Tree is fighting grass. Blaziken can, can stay in. No, no, wait. Shift Tree is dark, I think. Oh, wait, I'm not changing. Yeah, Shift Tree is dark grass. It's not fighting. Why did I say fighting? Okay, Blaze Kick. I'm confused. Okay. 
Okay, I'm confused. Blaziken should be strong enough to tank a hit from himself if he hits himself. And then also... He should be able to tank a hit if Shift Tree, because he can only do Dark and Grass-type moves, I think. I genuinely don't think he would have a Flying-type move. But to be safe, because I assume Blaziken will stay in this fight, I'm going to make him not confused. So we're going to use a berry. Parison berry. Blaziken is no longer confused. Double team. Okay, good. He didn't attack. That was good. It just raises his evasiveness, but that's fine. Blaze kick again. It missed. That's okay. Torment. Wait, what's torment? Oh no. Oh no, what's Torment? I don't know. Can I look it up? Am I, uh, uh, am I allowed to look it up? Can I look it up? I'm looking it up. Fuck it. I'm looking it up. Torment Pokemon. Oh my god, I spelled both words wrong. Okay, Torment prevents the target from using the same move twice in a row. No! The effect, the effect lasts until the target is switched out. If a Pokemon has selected the move that it used last turn, it becomes affected with Torment, it may still want to or use the move this turn. Okay. But, okay. Prevents the target from using the same move twice in a row. If a Pokemon has selected the move it used last turn and becomes affected with Torment, it may still use the move this turn. Okay, so it's saying from this point on, I cannot move use two moves in a row. I think. Oh, that's fine. I was wrong. Oh wait, he's he's dark and grass. I could just do double kick. I forgot. I have two move types that are effective. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's only the second Pokemon. Elite Four Sydney is about to use Absol. Light change. Absol is dark. No, I will not change. The only problem is I can't use double kick now. I should be fine to tank. Blaze kick. Oh yeah, I can't move, use the same move twice in a row. So if I alternate between blaze and blaze and double kick, I'll be fine. Elite Four Sydney is about to use Crawdent. Oh, Crawdent is water. He's water. Oh. Oh no. Will I change? No, wait, no, it's Crawdent. Crawdent is like that little orange pincer thing. Didn't we see Crawdent in the desert? Okay, Crawdent is either water or ground. <laughs> so that means probably the most effective would be Gyarados. I think Crawdent was ground? Oh. Wait, that's... <laughs> Wait, okay, he's still got an orange. <laughs> Wait, I'm so stupid. <laughs> I was thinking of the little, like, bug-looking thing. I didn't think it was the evolve or a crawfish. Well, it's still good that I swapped out Blaziken, right? Uh... <laughs> um... I guess the only Pokemon that would have had the type advantage would have been Belossum. But is, is Crot- I assume the Crotent is like dark water, right? Because this guy seems like he's a dark and evil build. I will not swap out. Now, gamers, this is the only time where I will allow you to give me a hint. Is ice effective against water? You can leak. You can snitch. Is ice effective against water? No? Okay, that makes sense. 
I know that fire is strong against ice. Okay, well, basically... Gyarados has no type advantage. But then that also means he should be able to take a hit. And I don't want to put up Blossom because Blossom does not have a lot of HP. I'll do Bite, because if he flinches, then I'll take out Blossom. Oh. Sword Dance, Monka. Attack sharply rose. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. This might feel like taking a final for you? No, it is. I've been studying for 129 hours. Okay, uh, uh... His attack rose. I think Surf is my strongest move. Whoa, that did a lot of damage. took 63 damage. Should I heal? No. 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 I don't- Okay, the only way he would take me out next turn is if he has a, he has a crit. I feel like I should heal. No, he might heal too. No, okay. Crotted is at less than half HP. I feel like he's going to heal, so I'm going to heal as well. I need something that gives me 60. Right here, soda pop. Strength again! Surf again. Stressing out so bad over the first battle? Shut up! This was 129 hours of work! I'm gonna have like a panic attack on stream. I'm not even kidding. I'm fine, I'm fine. Uh, editor, cut out the parts where I say I'm anxious. I want a hundred HP heal. Two hundred. Yeah, I only have a two hundred heal. <laughs> oh. Magikarp does not have a move that is guaranteed to go first, but I am faster. Either Crawdend is going to heal, or they're going to attack. And if they attack, I go first. So I'm going to do Surf in anticipation that he does a full heal. Yep. I was right. So now Surf will take out about half their HP and then I will heal next turn. Now I heal. Hyper Potion just because I want a full health bar. I 
I think even if it's a crit, I should be fine. I really want to try bite. That way I can do like... A... Wait, I forgot! I have an item that has a chance to do a flinch. I forgot to activate that held item. That's fine. I'd rather have the citrus berries, honestly. Surf again. I should be fine. Now I heal. speed advantage right now but I think it's smarter to heal in case it misses I really should have organized my bag. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna catch legendaries on this playthrough. I just wanna beat the game, honestly. Oops, that was an uh, misclick. Okay, now we do surf again. Okay, this is over. Next Pokemon. Elite for Sydney is about to use Cacturn. Will I change? Uh, yeah, Cacturn is dark grass, so Blaziken, you're up, sir. And they shouldn't have the Torment anymore, because I withdrew them. Oh, he was doing the stanky leg. Blaze Kick should kill it. Gym done. You defeated Elite Force Sydney. Plus one. Well, how do you like that? I lost. Eh, it was fun, so it doesn't matter. You got four thousand nine hundred Poké dollars for winning. Well, listen to what this loser has to say. You got what it takes to go far. Now go on to the next room and enjoy your next battle. Whew. There we have it. One Elite Four member on the board! Okay, now we gotta heal up. He's a loser for real on God on God. We're gonna give Magikarp the Citrus Spray back. I still don't want to keep Magikarp as my opener because he does have, have Intimidate. And I definitely think that was helping. Only six more? There's not six. No. No, there... I know there's a champion at the end, but there can't be six, right? Okay, okay. Let's heal everybody up. Magikarp is maxed out. Okay. Double checking my party one more time. Yeah, everybody is full healed. Everybody has a berry. We should be good. On to the next fight. Wait. Let me out of here! Wait, she's cute! I bet you five bucks this is poison. Or psychic. <laughs> I'm Phoebe of the Elite Four. I did my training on Mount Pyre. Wait, that's fire. While I trained, I gained the ability to commune with ghost-type Pokemon. Yes, the bond I developed with Pokemon is extremely tight. 
So come on, just try and see if you can even inflict damage on my Pokemon. Wait, she's cute! Elite 4 Phoebe would like to battle. They sent out a Dusclops, level 48. Okay. Ghost type Pokemon are weak against Dark type. And also, Blaze Kick works as well. So if I just bite, 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 like nibble on, sorry, nibble on the Pokemon, it should be fine. And I have the speed advantage. Protect, that's fine. It's okay. I have a lot of PP for bite. I'm fixing it, I'm fixing it, I'm fixing it, I'm fixing it. Hi heart, welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Okay, I'm fixing the camera, guys. I'm back. Guys, don't clip when I have tech issues. Because if that clip goes virus, people are going to think I'm a robo streamer. Type 1. Who has their popcorn microwaved and ready for when I inevitably lose? Okay, we're back in it. Bite. Die! <laughs> oh wait, he has a lot of HP. Any blitz? Go with you! No, I'm confused! Dude! The only ghost type move I'm scared of is the one where he has the little ear nose and it stretches and I'm cursed. I assume Magikarp will be the main fighter in this battle, so I'm gonna make sure he's not confused. Magikarp is snapped out of confusion. Oh, full restore. Classic, classic, classic. Even if I did an offensive move, it wouldn't have mattered. So it's good that I did the berry there. Die! <laughs> Elite 4 Phoebe is about to use Bennett. Will I change? Uh, no. I know Bonette has cursed. Didn't you guys make me throw away Bonette and I was really sad? We're biting this. Yummy. That's huge, he flinched! Two hit K! Oh! Elite 4 Phoebe is about to use Dusclops. Will I change? Uh, no. Imagine having only one Pokemon type for your entire team. That's honestly really silly. Level 51? Monka. Another crit and he flinched? Oh my god. So easy. <laughs> you got a Citrus Berry too? But look what I have. Another bite. Wait, that did less damage, but he flinched. W. This should kill? <gasps> no! Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit. Die. You see this? The move becomes less effective when you spam it. Oh, that kind of makes sense. Magikarp, go to level 59! Let's go! Elite 4 Phoebe is about to use Bonette. Will I change? Nah. Okay. 
Surely I won't die. Ooh, I only got four bites left. They're going easy on you, low-key. I mean, that's only the second leader, right? I think I'm gonna heal here. Just so I have, like, a full status heal. That way, if Bennett does curse me, I don't die on impact. Magikarp is healed by 50 points. Grudge? Bennett wants the opponent to bear a grudge. I'm looking that up. I believe in peace, love, and happiness. I don't like grudges. Even though I am a very vindictive person. Grudge Pokemon. Move. It decreases the PP of the target's move to zero if that move causes the user to faint. Oh. So that means... If I'm- if I KO Bennett with Bite, then it'll remove all the remaining PP. Oh. I mean, that's fine. Because my Bite already has four left, so it's kind of worth to just go for it. And if anything, I can use Lepaberry next turn. Grudge again? weird. I can just swap out for Blaziken. Yup. Magikarp's Bite lost all its PP due to the Grudge. Okay, good thing I looked it up. It's fine. There's only two PP left anyway. Elite 4 PB is about to use Sableye. Will I change? Yes. Sableye technically has no weakness, but I think Blaze Kick worked the best, so we're gonna switch to Blaze again. I do believe Sableye has Curse as well. I missed. Okay, Nightshade was a dark type move. Blaze kick again. There we go. Nice. Double team to raise evasiveness. You know, I'm gonna heal this turn. Just in case he curses me. Even though I hate swearing. Good thing I healed here, because they healed as well. You know who else could use some healing? Those who are not following the channel, because guys, we are another 30 minutes in the stream, so if you're new here, click that follow button, you get clue modes, and you get to type a chat. Isn't that pretty sick? Can we hit our daily goal of 5 followers? Please kick again. Double team to raise evasiveness. That probably means they don't have another heal. Does quick attack work? Oh, awkward. Awkward. They do not have another heal. Blaze kick again. Let's see if it works. It works. W! Also, 130 hour, guys. You defeated Elite Four Phoebe. Two for two, baby. Oh, darn. I've gone and lost. You got 5,100 Poké Dollars for winning. Whew. There's a definite bond between you and your Pokémon, too. I didn't recognize it, so it's only natural that I lost. Yep, I'd like to see how far your bond will carry you. Go ahead. Move on to the next room. Look at that. Look at that. Another gym leader on the board. Okay, now we heal. Doubters and shambles. I 
I cannot imagine doing an itemless run. I would, like, shit myself in fear. Just you wait. No, don't. Don't, don't. I'll be fine. Everybody's fully healed. Everybody has a citrus berry. On to the next gym leader, Elite Four. Wait, I want to go back. Let me go back. I'm blue. Abudi. Abuda. I assume this is ice. No, I'm not gonna save. If I have to reset, we go from the beginning. Welcome. My name is Glacia of the Elite Four. I've traveled from afar to Hoenn so that I may hone my ice skills. But all I have seen are challenges by weak trainers and their Pokemon. What about you? It would please me to no end if I could go out of against you. Yup. I believe fire is weak against or strong against ice. Elite Four Glacia would like to battle. They have five Pokemon. Elite Four Glacia sent out Celia, level 50. My only concern is that the ice types would also have water moves, so I don't necessarily want to take out Glaziken. I forgot to raise my pee, -pee up. Shoot. Oh, man. Physical moves aren't too strong against Ralph. Maybe this is a Blossom type beat? Gamers, I'm going to ask you again. <laughs> is Grass strong against... Ice? I'm not sure because, like, ice can break plants, like, during an ice storm. They're weak against ice? Oh no! <laughs> uh, so probably safest bet? Oh wait, I have a new trick! Should we put in Manny? Should we do it? Should we do it? Should we do it? Mm. You know what? We're balling. Fuck it. It started to hail. That raises their power. Okay, the hail is fine. Spark can paralyze. Thunder is 70% accuracy. Bite is dark. Quick. Let's do Spark to paralyze. Electric is strong against ice, baby! I assume the leader is going to full heal, so I'm also going to heal. Manny's are men! Even though Manny's a girl. Manny's are men! <laughs> okay, I could have I could have taken him out that turn. Spark again and hopes they paralyze. Oh he's dead anyway. L. Let's go! Elite for Glacia is about to use Glalie. Glalie is just ice. Will I change? No. I think I should heal this turn. No, no, I'm not gonna heal. I'm gonna do Spark first, because I don't think there's any way 
that I can be taken out because I still have my citrus berry. I'm going to spark to see if I can paralyze first. The hail stopped. Good. It, it lowers their power. Use my citrus berry. I'm back to 70. I still have to heal. Right now I'm down 100 HP, so... Let's do the hyper potion. Wait, where is it? Just because Manny lost their citrus berry. Frozen. Okay, so if I'm frozen, I still can take damage at the end of the turn, so I should I should do a full restore here. That was close. Fully restores the HP and status of a Pokemon. I only have 10. We're using it. Problem is, if they do Ice Beam again, it could be Jover. Oh. I have to do Spark. I have to. <gasps> He's paralyzed! I'm so cold! My speed fell, Mocha. But he's paralyzed. That is huge. I have the speed advantage. The gym leader has not had the chance to use a full restore on this Pokemon yet. My speed just fell too. I should heal. It's not a guarantee that I'll be first. Okay, we're even. Full restore, full restore. And you know what? Since they're. Oh, they're not paralyzed anymore. Should I do thunder? Should I just be like, screw it, thunder? No, I need to paralyze first. Light screen. Raise special defense. Cool. Yes! Thunder. Die. Oh, that didn't even do much. Sad. My speed fell again! Yeah, electric are a special type. That's why the thunder didn't, like, kill him. I'm debating if I should heal or not. Because I assume Glalie is completely out of heals. I could switch to Blaze again, like somebody suggested, but I don't really want to do that in the middle of a fight. I'd rather wait till the next Pokemon. Because if I try Spark again, it will not KO. I'm gonna heal. That way, if they do Ice Beam, I'm safe. I see wind lowering my speed again. He's really cooking me. I assume he's gonna keep raising and raising, or he's gonna keep decreasing my speed. That way the one time I try to attack, he's gonna hit me with an ice beam. I 
have quick attack though. Let's try it. Isn't quick attack like a guaranteed first move? He's still decreasing my speed. The light screen wore off. So maybe that was the strat, just to stall out the light screen? And Glalie is still paralyzed, but they're making every single move. What is going on? I assume since the light screen is gone, Glalie is going to do Ice Beam, so we're gonna heal one more time. I was right! I was right. The Browsers ain't doing jack shit. At least I'm not frozen. I don't think if I did Spark, it would take him out. I assume what he's trying to do is making me keep using my heals. Which is fine, because I have 20. If he does the icy wind again... <gasps> He's paralyzed! Huge! W! This is when we strike. I'm doing thunder for the risk. Yes! Yes, sir! Okay, that's good, because Manny's back to full health now. Elite for Iglesia is about to use Celio. Will I change? Uh, no, sir. Hey, no, wait. There's still three Pokemon left? <sighs> Starting off with Spark. Wow! And he's paralyzed! This is a kid's game. <laughs> Elite Four Glacia is about to use Glalie. Will I change? No. Hail continues to fall. Thunder. I should have done spark, dang it. Bunker. I should have switched to Blaze again, huh? is now I'm not gonna have a chance to like make a hit that did less damage the hail has stopped falling so I think that means even if it's an ice beam unless it's a crit I'll live Such a jerk. <sighs> now if he ice beams, I die. I 
I'm healing so much, it's pathetic. Stop! Seriously! So that Ice Beam did 90 damage. It's doing less damage. I think the... The point of the more times you do the move in succession, the least powerful it, or the less powerful it gets is true. Because the first time it hit me, it was like 120 before crit. I really should have started with Spark. I don't want to lose Manectric, though. I knew it. Everybody, peace, I do seven Manectric. That could have been avoided. Man. Pokemon fans? Is Blaziken fire strong against ice? I think so, right? Because fire, because fire melts ice. Otherwise, I can bring in Magikarp and he can tank. Okay, that's what I thought. Okay. We'll put out Blaziken. Sad. I really hope there's not a water gym later. Cut to when there is, inevitably. Only one blaze kick left? Uh oh. Die. I should have just opened with blaze again. Oh my god. Walrin? Oh, walrus. Elite Ford Glacier is about to use Walrin. Will I change? Yes, because Blaziken is out of fire kicks. No, 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 no. What I should do... What I should do... What I, what I should do... Is give Blaziken the Lepaberry. I should have done that in between matches, but I totally forgot. type move, even though he's a walrus, surely. Oh my god, I'm so lucky. I'm so lucky. Okay, I have to- I have to switch to Gyarados. I have to. I have to. He'll just tank. It's fine. He'll tank. We'll just do bites. That way he'll be fine. Oh my god. And he also has Intimidate. Surf will not hurt me. I'm just gonna do bite, 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 bite. No! There's no BB left! I really should have checked this between the fights. Oh my god, I'm so dumb!
<laughs> Wait, PP pee -pee is a bad term? Yeah. <laughs> Surely he won't take me out. Flinch, 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 flinch! Flinch! Yeah! Now we heal. I don't think there's any move that the Brawl Boys can do that can, like, kill me. Flinch. Uh-oh. Oh, saved. Saved, saved. Hyper potion in case he does a crit. Man, it's so sad seeing Manny dead. Monka. Is today the day? Yes, sir. Hi, Electra. After five long months, it has to be today. I'm debating on if I should heal or bite, because the problem is... I don't think a crit for an ice beam would take me out. I think my best bet is to bite in hopes he flinch. Yeah. Okay. I think this is our last Pokemon, right? Yeah, that one only did 40. I'll try Twister. Why not? Oh wait, Ice is strong against Dragon. Okay, the crit? It only did 40 damage, so that means I lost... I lost 90 HP with that crate. Okay, I definitely need to heal. Smile. I think the only move I can truly do is bite. Ha, huh, dumbass bitch. Water should heal me, let's be honest. If it's a crit ice beam, I will live. Maybe they ran out of pee pee. really mad.
They ran out of ice beam PP. They ran out. That means all I have to do is tank, and I'll be fine. You're not gonna have any moves left by the last member? Oh, I have Leopard Berries. I'll be fine. I just literally forgot to use the Leopard Berries in between the fights. I'll be fine. I have like 30 Leopard Berries. Yes, he flinched! Now, since he flinched, we're going to use the Lepa Berry to increase our bite PP. Now this is just a battle of attrition. Two more hits. Am I allowed to revive? No. But I'm gonna do this first try, don't you worry. You defeated Elite Four Glacia! You and your Pokemon, how hard your spirits burn! The all-consuming heat overwhelms. It's no surprise that my icy skills failed to harm you. You got 5,300 Poké Dollars for winning. Advance to the next room, and there confront the truly fearsome side of the Pokémon League. Wait, fearsome? What does that mean? Oh my god, that, that battle took 30 minutes. It took like 20-30 minutes. Oh my god, I'm shaking in my boots! There we go, holy moly! Oh, okay. You know what, guys? Glacia on the board! All we have left is the final gym leader. And then... The champion. Holy moly, I'm so nervous still. But you know what? I feel like I can do it. The ice battle would have been so much easier if I went into the fight making sure I had all my Lepa Berries redeemed. So we're gonna do that during the ad break. Because guys, we are two hours into stream. I've been doing the Elite Four for an hour now. So if you don't want to miss a single second, subscribe right now for $5.99, just $6. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe to see if you got a free sub available right now. Okay. Get some water and some popcorn, because the final fights are coming up. Oh my god, the ice gym, holy shit, oh my god! I'm not gonna lose this, I'll be fine. Slow and steady, you're doing good, thank you. I bet the doubters are still shaking in their boots! Okay, I'm not gonna make the same mistake as last time. We're gonna make sure everybody is fully healed and has full PP, Sag, Manny. It's so sad how the characters don't like jump anymore. This is so entertaining. It's so fun watching somebody learn the game. I'll be honest. <laughs> I hate watching beginners play games. It pisses me off. <laughs> but I do appreciate how you guys are really nice. Misclick. I'm gonna use the potions in between battles. That way I don't waste the larger heals. I do sometimes want to furiously type out help, but I live it myself to yes or no. And that's really good. And healthy. <laughs> That's why, like, sometimes I'll watch Twitch on my computer. Because it's a lot harder for me to type on the computer than on my phone. <laughs> 
Okay, now let's double check Blaziken's. Oh my god, he almost died. That would have been devastating if we lost Blaziken again. Holy. Oh, Blaziken's... Cool. Don't tell me Graveler has self-destruct. You wanna see? You wanna see? He does not only have self-destruct, he has explosion! <laughs> he has explosion, which is like so much stronger than self-destruct. You know, we added it for the meme. It would be really funny if Gavin died on the last fight. It would be hilarious. Yeah, Twitch Mobile sucks. And you know what? They're launching the Discovery tab to be the default application that opens now. Like, everybody's Twitch app should be updated by the end of the week. And I'm sorry, Twitch staffers, if you're listening to this, like, just close your ears for a second. The UI for the new app is fine, but the problem is it's a lot harder to see people's stream titles. I know when I watch Twitch on mobile, it's throughout the day. Like, I only watch Twitch on desktop when I have, like, a designated time where I can, like, sit at my computer and enjoy a stream. But if I'm watching on mobile, I'm usually lurking. So in order for me to watch a stream on mobile, I have to see the title. But the new UI for the mobile app, you have to click the hamburger menu, and then it just shows the streamer being live. Not their titles or anything, I don't think. So, I know because of this new UI change, I'm, UI change, I'm not gonna watch streamers on mobile. I'm not. And they said in the post that 50% of users now use, or 50% of users are dedicated mobile watchers, and even the desktop users still use the mobile app throughout the day. So, Twitch, I'm sorry, but I know you're trying to make your app more like a social media platform, but it's not, it's not what people go to Twitch for. People go for long-form content, not casual content. Like, people want content to fill dead air throughout their day. They don't want, like, brain-dead content to fill in for five minutes, like Tic Tac or YouTube Shorts. Anyway. Twitch, just keep leading into long-form content. That's what you do best. That's what people go to the platform for. Do not make shorts or vertical videos the default opening tab. It's gonna prevent users from using it. Anyway, Twitch staff, you can, like, listen again. I know you love the peace and stream. Okay. Now we gotta give everybody berries. Many. Oh, I have to give it. I feel like every social media app wants to be everything. You mean like X, the everything app? I, th I know it's really funny because a huge criticism that most social media platforms had when Snapchat started popping off, everybody's like, oh my god, everybody's copying Snapchat. You know, stories, filters, but... Honestly, all the social media apps copying each other's UI just makes me feel like they're all the same. So UI is not a huge proponent that users look out for. They look for content now. <sighs> okay. I think I am ready, guys. Sedge Manny. <laughs> okay, we're going to move Manny to the bottom. That way I don't like accidentally misclick him or something. Everybody is fully healed. Everybody's PP is revived. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and then also everybody has a citrus berry. <sighs> we continue on. You know what? I'll say it. I think YouTube and Twitch are the strongest video platforms. Because they have the longest video formats. Anyway, guys, uh, since we're talking about YouTube, make sure you subscribe to my channel. I do weekly stream highlights, so if you can't watch the stream every day, watch the videos. It'll have the meat and potatoes of the banger streams we do. Also, the chess. I play my greatest enemy in chess. That YouTube video is doing really well for a peace in video. 
I usually only get 20 views for a video. It's at like 120. Holy shit. I've also gained like five subs. W. Okay. We have defeated Glacia. Can I like do a trick on her? <laughs> anyway. We continue on to the fourth member of the Elite Four. Wait, I wanna get out of here! Don't tell me he's a water gym leader! Don't tell me! But it's red, it should be like fire, right? Surely. I am the last of the Pokemon League Elite Four. Drake, the Dragon Master. <gasps> Drake! It's beam! In their natural state, Pokemon are wild living things. They are free. At times, they hinder us. At times, they help us. For us to battle with Pokemon as partners, do you know what it takes? Do you know what is needed? If you don't, then you will never prevail over me. I have Ice Beam and Gyarados! Yes! Yeah! Wait, he's not wearing a shirt. He should be in the hot tubs category. Anyway. Elite Four Drake would like to battle. He has five Pokemon. Elite Four Drake sent out Shelgun. Level 52. Yes, Magikarp! Yes! I don't think Shelgun is steel. I think he's just dragon because he evolves into the little blue dragon thing. Good thing we gave Magikarp Ice Beam. The only hindrance may be... I might run out of PP. You are such a wimp. Die. I'm fine. Rock Tomb won't kill me. Isn't drag dragon effective against dragon? Wait, really? Let's try that. Cause sh wait, Shogun might do a full revive, but I'll be fine. Bah, it's fine. It's fine. Twister is the only dragon move I have. Let's see. What? What? That's so stupid. Dragon is only effective against dragon? Wait, that's hilarious. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, well, I think Twister can also flinch. That's so funny. So I guess maybe I should open with Twister and then do Ice Beam. My speed fell. I'm debating on if I should heal here. I'm going to heal here. That way I don't have to heal as soon in the next Pokemon. My Gyarados is just water. Oh, wait. Yeah, I don't think he's a dragon type. Yeah, he's water flying for some reason. So even if the dragon types do dragon against me, I'll be fine. Yup! Let's go easy! I cannot wait to ban Ethan. I cannot wait! Elite Four Drake is about to use Salamence. Will I change? Uh, no, because Salamence is a dragon. Wait, he might be dragon flying. He also has Intimidate, but that's fine because I. Wait! Did my Intimidate not work? Oh. Ice Beam can freeze, I just remembered. You are such a smart player. Oh my god. 
a crit on the first hit? Oh my god, let's go! Elite 4 Drake is about to use Altaria. Altaria is dragon flying, so I should be fine. Will I change? Uh, no. That'd be D-O-M. I will heal, though. Since we're nearing the end, I will use a Hyper Potion just to have full HP. Sag Manny! Monka. Ice Beam? Double Edge is fighting. And it's hit with recoil? Okay, that's fine. Elite 4 Drake is about to use King Kingdra. Kingdra is dragon water. I should be fine. Cancel prediction? No. No. Will I change? Uh, no. That'd be DOM. Oh, wait. Kingdra may also have a dragon type move. Oh, wait. Ice won't be as effective, though. I think Kingdra might have poison, because I remember seeing that in the anime. But poison won't kill me. Ooh, maybe I should try bite. That way I can make him flinch. But let's do Twister. Dragon Dance increases their attack. I should be fine. I'll just heal next turn. That did not do a lot of damage. I just want to top off my HP. Uh oh, stop dancing. Ice Beam, because it has like a higher base attack stat. More like dragon damps. <laughs> okay, this guy is really strong defense. Its speed is rising too. I know I'm scared. Tengo miedo, pero estoy bien. I kind of want to try bite. Because the ice beam and twister aren't really working. I kind of want to have a chance to make him flinch. What? I'm paralyzed? What? Where's my full restore? I have nine full restores, honestly, and I'm being completely honest. I don't want to paralyze heal and then get taken out. I think it's smarter at this point just to use a full restore. Because I was already down 70 HP, yeah. I don't want to be paralyzed. Okay, stop it with the dragon dance. Seriously, stop. Bite? Because I want him to flinch. Hyper Beam incoming? Oh wait, I forgot about that. Oh, that was a crit. I thought that was normal damage. I'm healing. I figured a Hyper Beam was coming. And now I'm like really, 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 really scared. Oh, I only have three Hyper Potions left. Uh-oh. Mocha.
Look at him not healing. No, I'm scared the moment I try to like go for a move, he's gonna clap me. Cause that body slam does 90? Yeah, 90 damage. If it's a crit, I die. I wonder what would happen if I put Ralph in. Like, what's the craziest thing that could happen? Wait, this is only the second Pokemon. I'm just now realizing. Oh, I have 12 Hyper Potions. I was looking at my Ether. I'm fine. Smoke screen? My accuracy fell. Ice beam? And hoping that it freezes? He's gonna full restore. That's annoying. Wait, should I use a super potion? It would get me to 170. Yeah, I'll do a regular super potion. Yep, that's fine. That's okay. I expected that. Stop with the dragon dance! You're scaring me! He's not- he's probably not freezing because he's water type, right? Full heal? Or not a full heal, just maxing out my HP. Okay, so the moveset that Kingdra has, Body Slam, Smoke Screen. Wait, I should be writing this down as I go. <laughs> Kid, Body Slam, Smoke Screen, Dragon Dance. He's not shown the third move yet, which it probably is Hyper Beam. Full restore. Bro. I can't get a hit on him. Super potion and hopes there's no crit. And also, I wish there was an item that gave me 100 HP. That'd be great. Because I have a citrus berry too. Dragon dance, okay. Speed rose. That did more. Oh yeah, the dragon dance.
Is this a Pokemon battle or a Pokemon heal over and over and over and over and over? Go back to the writer's room. You know, it was a mistake wearing a suit coat because I'm sweating. Not because I'm nervous, because it's hot in here. Do I just tank? I feel like I'm gonna run out of heals though. No, I don't want to reset. Yeah, I have to. Good thing I didn't waste a Hyper Potion on the previous turn. Did he run out of Body Slam? Did he? Okay. Paralyzed. I I'm fine. He gave me like a glimmer of hope. I'm gonna run out of heals! Uh-oh. You know, before we went in, I was like, buying 20 of every heal is obnoxious. Dumbass bitch. I should still heal here in case he does another body slam. You can never have too many heals in a Nuzlocke, so real intro. He's baiting me! He's baiting me again! Wait. Maybe he's actually out of body slam. Twister, maybe he'll flinch. Smoke screen. And Serio. Also, we still don't know what his fourth move is. If it's Hyper Beam, it's Jober. He might actually. <gasps> He might actually be out of Body Slam. Dude, seriously! He could only have three moves? Maybe. I, I definitely do agree that like if he had a fourth move, he would have used it by now. Yep, he's out.
My accuracy is so low. Imagine they get to 1 HP and they full restore. That would be hilarious. I'm gonna try Bite so they flinch. Oh, that did a significant chunk. I only have nine super potions left? Oh no. They still have like three more Pokemon, I think. A crit. Oh no. Oh no. What I really need is the bite to flinch. Oh, he's faster than me. Okay. I'm gonna bite because I should be able to tank. Yeah, it's another surf. I'm fine. Insetio? Yeah, he, it seems like he only has Surf. That one only did 20. Really? Oh my god, I'm so annoyed. I'm so annoyed. out of potions oh no oh no he only has smoke screen I think yeah hit it could be smart to swap in for Ralph here if he does smoke screen one more time yep Right, I could swap to I could swap to Blossom. I'm crying. Yeah, I'm crying at the club right now. I just have to wait until I get a hidden. He's dead. Thank goodness. Finally. Elite 4 Drake is about to use Flygon. Will I change? Wait, Flygon is Grass? Is Grass Dragon or Flying Dragon? Because it's the green guy. He's flying? Okay, that's what I thought. I mean, I see green and I think grass. Also, guys, we're another 30 minutes in the stream. 
So if you're new here, click that follow button. If you're lurking and you like what you see, click follow. You get cool emotes and you get to type a chat. And if you're already following, make sure your notifications turn on. I think ground and dragon? What? <laughs> what? Wait, but then... If it's ground dragon, then Magikarp can stay in. Because water is strong against ground, but not rock. Not rock. Wait, this is last Pokemon! <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Monka. I'm fixing it. I'm fixing it. Yeah, I pee pee poofed. Okay, we're back in. I healed. If Flygon is ground, surf. Dragon Myth, I should be fine. Is it worth it to use it now? Down 50 HP. I think right now I need to preserve turns. So I'm fine with using a full restore here. If I'm paralyzed again. A crit? It's the last Pokemon for this leader, though. And there's one more champion after this. I know that for sure. Is the Elite Four how you expected? I honestly thought it'd be harder. But it's not as hard because I do have... A decent type team. Gyarados is hard carrying. I feel I should just paralyze heal here. Hopefully I'll be fine. It seems like he's spamming Dragon Breath. Let's just see if Surf will work. I won't be taken out here, I'll be fine. And I missed. I can't move. Not paralyzed. Maybe it's missing because he's flying. <laughs> I should have just been doing ice beam. What am I doing? I'm losing my mind.
I'm gonna try and fight. He's playing just like how I would play, just spamming one move! And I'm scared because the AI usually does not do this. Magikarp does have a Lep- or a Citrus Berry. How many times did you get smoke screened? A lot, apparently. <laughs> Should I swap? Maybe the Flygon only has one move? I do not believe that for a second. Convinced if I put in Ralph, Ralph will be fine. Plus, this is the last Pokemon. And you're right. If I leave Magikarp in, his accuracy is still the same. Ooh, Levitate! Levitate is why the Surf wasn't hitting, I think. Psychic, because this could confuse. Wow. Flamethrower? What? What? Oh, he's dead! He's dead! Yes! Yes! Magic Ralph grew to level 60. Ralph grew to level 59. You defeated Elite Four Drake. I should have just switched to Ralph in the beginning. Superb, it should be set. You got 5,500 Poké Dollars for winning. You deserve every credit for coming this far as a trainer of Pokémon. You do seem to know what is needed. Yes, what a trainer needs is a vict Virtuous. Virtuous, what? Yes, what a trainer needs is a virtuous heart. Pokémon touch the ground. <laughs> Sorry, I can't read. Pokemon touch the good hearts of trainers and learn good from wrong. They touch the good hearts of trainers and grow strong. Go on, onwards. The champion is waiting. Wait, no. I don't want to. The suffering is over? No, he said the champion is there! Okay, I'm gonna test something. No, I can't. Okay, I cannot go back and heal. I, d I just wanted to see if I could do that. Uh-oh. Monka. Okay, this is not looking good. I have 20 max potions? Okay. Four full restores, five super potions. Nine regular potions. And six hyper. The champion just congratulates you. No battle, you're lying. I know you're lying. I forgot. I can use berries to heal. I was freaking out that I didn't have heals. But I can literally heal with berries. Oh my god, I'm so DUM. I was freaking out because I was like, oh my god, I have no more heals. But I could have been using berries too. I wish you didn't know that there'd be a champion. No, because the max level that the champion has is 58. And we haven't seen a... 58 Pokemon yet, I don't think. Or maybe we did, but I wasn't really paying attention.
<sighs> Guys, type one if you believe. Now, I do have an inkling suspicion that the champion is water. Because water was the gym typage for the final gym. Like, the closest gym to here was water. Okay. Now we're gonna check everybody's PP levels. Ice Beam and Twister. Surf, I can also refill too. Since this is the final fight, I kind of want to make sure everything has full PP. Because I have 23 Leopard Berries, I might as well use them. Everybody else is good. Okay. Everybody's fully healed. Most everyone's attacks are topped off too. Everybody has a citrus berry. Now time for the champion. I'm so scared. Wait, let me go back! Why, did, why are the lights flashing? I'm scared. Wait, this could be a Blossom Clutch. Welcome, Peason. That incident in Pseudopolis City. That was superb work, putting an end to that crisis all by yourself. Huh, <laughs> oops. It wouldn't be fair to say that you alone ended the crisis. You overcame that difficult situation by working as one with your Pokémon. We trainers raise Pokémon by giving them items and by teaching them new techniques for battle. But we ourselves also learn many things from Pokémon. And this is where your achievements are put to the test against what others like you have achieved. Now, who can most elegantly dance with their Pokemon in Hoenn? Show me right here and now. Oh yeah, we didn't fight Wallace, we just saw him at the gym. Oh, because everybody was like, oh my god, Wallace is gone. He has six Pokemon. Champion Wallace would like to battle. They sent out a Whale Lord, level 57. Whale Lord has water. And then also a ground type move. We could put in Blossom, but Blossom is three levels below, so I kind of only want to put Blossom in whenever we're switching Pokemon. I feel like Ralph could also be good since Wallace is a water type, but for this fight, we'll keep in Magikarp since they're both water. That's not too bad. Rain Dance will also make me stronger, silly. Imagine Whale Lord has Hyper Beam. Oh, I'm so cold! Uh oh. <laughs> that did a good chunk. Flinch, flinch, flinch.
I really want to put in Ralph. But I don't want to waste a turn. Only four super potions left. Oh, you missed, sucker. The rain stopped. Thank you for the follow, plus one! Thank you! Can we get some yo's? Okay. Let's see. Blizzard only has five PP? Wait, that's crazy. I think my strongest offensive move is Ice Beam. But I don't think it'll be too strong. I think I'm probably safest just biting still. He flinched, but he's going to full restore here for sure. So I'm going to heal. Yep. The AI is so predictable! He flinched again. W. I'll be fine with the blizzard. That did a lot. Okay, I'm gonna write down what he has. He has Rain Dance and Blizzard. He probably has Rollout as well. Ooh, you missed, you sucker! Double edge, okay. Double edge is either fighting or normal. That's fine. I'm probably safe fighting one more time. Water spout? <laughs> okay, so right now the moveset is Rain Dance, Blizzard, Double Edge, and Water Spout. I should be fine. I should be fine. Bite one more time, and then the next Pokemon we might swap to Blossom or Ralph. One out of six completed. Rollout isn't too strong an offensive move. Champion Wallace is about to use Tentacruel. Will I change? Yes. Because Psychic is strong against Poison. And Tentacruel is poison water. I'm not putting Blaziken in. Clear body has been traced. Psychic. Nice. I'm badly poisoned. Oh, that's nothing. That's nothing. W! Two out of six. Champion Wallace is about to use Ludicolo. Ludicolo, Ludicolo does have the dark type move, but they're normal water, I believe. Or just water. Will I change? 
You know what? Maybe we can try tossing Blossom. Why not? Wait, let's see what the moves do first. Poison Powder. Petal Dance. Ooh, a rampage of two to three turns that confuses the user. Sleep Powder. And Solar Beam. Yeah, I don't know if Ludicolo is grass, but I know for sure Lotad is just water. Oh, wait. Lotad does have Absorb. So they have- I think they have Grass-type moves, but they're not grass. I think that's it. So, because I know if he tries to do Restore and Blossom, it will not work. I kind of want to put Blossom in, honestly. Petal Dance is 100% accuracy, Sleep Powder, and Solar Beam? Could go crazy. Let's try Blossom. Why not? First time ever battling with Blossom. Level 56. Oh. Pedal dance, because this will confuse it. Ooh, double time. Oh. Ooh, worked. Okay. So this will attack for two turns and also may confuse it. Surf shall not work against me. Oh, wait. Pedal turns takes two turns. Oh. Oh, wait, it confuses me? <laughs> wait, I thought it confused them. That's so funny. That's so funny. <laughs> um, let's see. <laughs> I don't think any of the moves can hurt me. We could just try Solar Beam. I want to see if it'll hit. Oh, I can still hit myself between turns? Wait, I can use it? Oh, wait, Solar Beam hits this turn, right? But Lawson looks so weird from behind. I know, it looks like a bald person. <laughs> Now, since I'm healing confusion, the solar beam should hit, right? Wait, what? Only hits in one turn when it's sunny? Wait, what? Absorbs light in one turn, then attacks the next turn. Oh, maybe because I was confused it didn't work? Yeah, it didn't use the it didn't use the PP. Yeah, I I agree. I think the confusion didn't activate it. That's fine. We can try next turn after I heal. Because I just want to see the animation for Solar Beam. To be frank, Monka. Let's try it. <gasps> oh, I took in sunlight. I should live. Come on! Whoa! That's so cool.
What? We'll just we'll try again since I have full HP. This time it'll kill, I promise. Come on, but Lossum. Surely double team will make it so I don't miss, right? Let's run it back! Run it back! I'll be fine. Ralph is still poisoned. I forgot. see the accuracy for the moves. Yeah, Solar Beam is 100% accuracy. Sleep Powder 75, Petal Dance 100, Poison Powder 75. Man, I wish Blossom had some more offensive moves. And you know what else I wish? To get some subscriptions, because guys, we are three hours in the stream. It's I told you guys this will take me a few hours to do this. So, it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid the ad by subscribing for $5.99, just $6. Skip your coffee and get ad-free viewing all month long. Or, you can link your Amazon Prime to Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you got a free sub available. And do it right now. For every single sub I get today, I'll say thank you. Get some water, get a snack. I'll see some of you guys in a few. Okay. I feel as if I should heal Blossom to full and then try another Solar Beam. I don't know if I have any berries that raise my accuracy. Yeah, nothing raises my accuracy, so I'm just gonna heal. You're so annoying with a double team. Genuinely. Solar beam again. Blossom, I believe in you. You can do this. I was thinking about doing Petal Dance, but either way, I need to get Blossom to full heal, because Petal Dance still takes two turns. Or full HP, I mean. Okay, the problem that's happening now is that Surf still does 30 damage against me. I 
I don't want to lose Blossom though. Let's try Petal Dance now. need to do because since Blossom's accuracy is so low right now I think I should heal Ralph and Magikarp and then I can just swap them in that's what I need to focus on Ralph was cured Swap in Ralph. Because if I can confuse Ludicolo, that'd be cool. And then I could just swap Blossom back in Swift Swim. Giga Drain. Uh oh. Leech Seed. I should be fine. see if Psychic does Confusion. Psychic does not confuse when Confusion can confuse. Citrus Berry? Because I don't think... Ludicolo can take me out. I am seated though, so I will lose another 20. This could have been a mistake to put in Ralph. This could have been a horrible mistake. They have the citrus berry. <sighs> it was a mistake to switch to Ralph without healing up the Lawson first. Could switch to Magikarp because they do have more HP right now, and I feel like the only move that could hurt would be Giga Drain. The only move he was doing against Blossom was Sir, but if I put Blossom in now, I think their accuracy would be improved, so I'm gonna put Blossom back in. This could be a mistake, but you know what? It's okay. I'm 
Man, I wish I had a restore type move too. I got 65. I'm gonna keep using Citrus Berries on Blossom because the moves don't do too well with Ludicolo. Yeah, Giga Drain only does like 15. I'm gonna try Solar Beam. Oh, it says evasiveness that keeps going up, so it's not my accuracy going down. Wait, he's using double team even though it's maxed? He's silly? Okay, maybe switching to Blossom was the strat? Does he only have double team left? Now this is good because now I can heal everybody up. <gasps> the battle of attrition. What it takes to win. I am not resetting. <laughs> what happens if you run out of moves, right? It's like a separate dialogue. He probably still has Leech Seed, you're right, but that's why it was a clutch to put in Blossom. Leech Seed, I evaded! <laughs> Just getting everybody max right now. If you run out of moves, it attacks with no type move and it harms itself. <gasps> That's crazy! Okay, right now, everybody is healed. That's what I wanted to do. So now we can try Solar Beam. I evaded W. Come on, Blossom, please. Now he only has Leech Seed. It doesn't affect me. Yes! Yes! Come on, Blossom. I knew you were the right pick. Oh, I lost. <laughs> I don't think the solar beam will KO. But even if it does or doesn't, I should still use the Lepa Berry to, rip to fill it up again. Struggling! Oh wait, that that hurts me. What is struggle? Pokemon fans? Is that the secret move? It's still doing like 20, 30 damage though. I'll try pedal dance.
I missed. And I'm confused. I could swap in Ralph. No, I'll keep a loss of men. We just gotta heal. This is only the third Pokemon of the champion, though. Whoa, a crit? Uh oh. wild because the struggle is affecting me more than any of little Kuro's moves did. Imagine struggling yourself. I don't have to imagine. I struggle all the time. Sag. Guys, type one if you're depressed. I'm kidding. <laughs> Here, okay, to make it fair, to make it fair. There, there we go. I'll be honest. I got diagnosed almost two years ago. Wait, look at him! He's gonna die. Dude, I swear I've used half my citrus berries on this Ludicolo. Girl? Take this L! Ideal meal. Champion Wallace is about to use Milotic. What? Milotic? Don't tell me what it is. Don't tell me what it is. Milotic? Giat incoming? You're done for? No! <laughs> Milotic? Okay, gamers, am I allowed to, like, look at a picture? Can I look at a picture? I've never heard of Milotic. It sounds like electric, though. Like, radical. Milotic? Oh, Milotic? <laughs> What? <laughs> I think I should be allowed to look at a picture. And then I can guess what the type is. I think that's fair. It sounds like electric. Milo Milotic. It evolves from the ugly Pokemon? Oh, wait, the brown fish? No, the ugly fish. Is it dragon? No. It could be dragon. Man, if I had... Dude, if I still had Manectric. I should have teached... I should have taught Gyarados Electric. I figured Milotic was, like, the pretty Pokemon that everybody, like, lusts over. Will I change Pokemon? Yes, sir. Peace, I, too. Hmm. I'm convinced... I think it's Dragon. Maybe dragon water? Either way, Magikarp is a tank. If I saw it, you'll be confused about the type. I think it's dragon. Dude, he has three Pokemon left. Oh yeah, Magikarp has Intimidate. Good thing I brought it up now. Ice Beam. A crit, and that did nothing. Oh, 
Oh wait, it's ice itself. Oh. Okay. Huh. Watch that fire. I feel I should heal here. Because I don't know what moves it has. Only two super potions left. Uh oh. Toxic. Maybe Ralph can clutch? Huh. This could be a Ralph angle. Ralph does not have a citrus berry, though. Looking at this Pokemon, I'm not convinced it has a dark type move. And what is cool is when you box the Pokemon, it doesn't take poison damage. You know what? Let's try it. Marvel Scale. Ooh! Let's see. <gasps> Monka. Not super effective, but it still worked. Uh-oh. Ralph does not have a citrus berry. So I'm gonna use my last super potion. Okay, I need to write down the moves. It has Surf, Ice Beam. What was the other one it just did? Okay, they do a lot of damage. Can I tell what the ability it copy does? Wait, I can look at my summary and maybe it's there. Oh, no. Yeah, tell me what the ability does. I'm fine with cheating. I mean, not cheating. <sighs> does it like do double damage or something? Gives you 50% more defense when under a status effect. Oh. So, like, confusing it may not be the best idea. In two moves, Ralph took... I'm gonna try confuse again. Come on, be confused. Oh, no. Okay, so it had Surf, Ice Beam, Recover... Oh, and then I had the poison one. Okay. I think Ralph can tank. Ralph can maybe clutch here. Let's see. They'd serve Ice Beam Recover in the poison one. None of them hurt me too much. I don't want to use the Hyper Potion. But it could be worth... No, I don't want to. Citrus Berry. Because none of the attacks that Mil Milo Tick can do will kill me. Okay, that... I might use the Hyper Potion now, just to like get full HP. This is Pokemon number four. God damn. Ooh, ghost? First time using it? Okay, not too bad. I'm poisoned! Monka. Full restore. You have 50%. More defense, though? Yeah, I don't... I don't mess with poison. That's how we lost Mudkip in my first or second save. I think
think Psychic is the strongest move. Yep. Jeez. Special defense fell. Let's go. Man, stop. They're using a citrus berry, not a full restore. Okay. I have one of four HP. I'm debating on if I want to do a full restore. Because I only have three. Because Ralph can tank. I think I'm just gonna do... No, I should do a full restore, just to be safe. Only two left after this. Dang. He's recovered, that's fine. I was expecting it. Psychic. And then I have to heal next turn. I'm not gonna do a full restore here. I'm just gonna do an antidote. Because next turn, they're not going to do an offensive. They're going to heal or recover. Because I need to reserve my full restores for the other two Pokemon. <sighs> they used their full restore on this Pokemon. That means they probably will not use another one. Best bet... Confusion in hopes it confuses it, please. Nope, okay. Okay. Monka. Dude, this would have been so easy if I had Manectric. I think I went through all my super heals or super potion. Yeah, Ralph will live, surely. Let's see. They had Surf, Ice Beam, Recover, and the Poison. Surf won't affect Blossom too much, but it still will do like 20-30 damage because they're lower level. Ice Beam, I'm unsure how it does against the Grass type. Recover, whatever. 
in the poison. I'm debating if I'm gonna switch into Blossom. Because the problem that's gonna happen is I'm gonna run out of heals. So, I think I can either swap into Blossom now and heal Blossom and Ralph and heal Magikarp so they're no longer poisoned, and then I can swap in Magikarp, try Biting and Twistering, because the Ice Beam doesn't really affect Magikarp or Gyarados. I think I will swap in Blossom, get Blossom to heal Ralph and Magikarp, and then we'll swap in for Gyarados. Because Blossom should be able to tank a hit here. Yep, Surf is fine. Only nine citrus berries left. Okay, the poison didn't do that much, but I'm still going to heal. And I think I should full restore here. That way Blossom, because Blossom's main job right now is just to heal everybody. Oh. Oh no. We learned today, ice is super effective against grass. We're gonna put Ralph back in to tank. Oh wait, I could've just unfroze Blossom. Ralph should be able to take another hit. Let's try Confusion. And then we have to heal on this turn. Monka. Three Harper Potions left. Oh no. Dude, I... I should have bought more. Jeez. I need to unfreeze Blossom and unpoison Magikarp. So since Ralph can tank, that's what we'll do. Recover is fine. It's okay. going to do an antidote here, not a full restore, because Ralph can tank.
One hyper potion left. We are going to swap into Gyarados. Because Gy Gyarados can take the Surf, the Ice Beam, and if he gets poisoned, he'll be fine. Yeah, I still do have max potions, but I'm saving those for, like, last, last resort. We're gonna swap in for Gyarados. Our goat. Lowering their attack again. That still did 30 damage. Bite hoping it flinches. That was a crit. That means normal damage is not significant. So we're going to try and make it flinch again. Bro. Oh wait, I have 20 max potions. Okay, cool. I'm at 113. I should be able to tank. Twister, I think, had 40 base attack power. But I don't know... Is Melodic Dragon? Let's see. I didn't try this yet. It is Dragon. But it, it did nothing. It did nothing. NOTHING! It's just like the Ludicolo fight again. I think Gyarados still has their Citrus Berry. Yeah, they do. I'm gonna Antidote, because Gyarados can tank. Uh-oh. I'm gonna use the max potion here. I don't want to use full restore. I'll do the ice heal next turn, I think. Classic! Recover when they had full HP. What does that mean? Hmm. Hmm. Are they out of moves as well? Oh no, they still got toxic.
They don't use toxic if you already have a status effect? Wait, that's huge. Actually. So then it's probably best if I get frozen to stay frozen. so funny. Wow. They're not doing ice beam no more, so maybe they're out of ice beam. Yeah, Ice Beam had a default of 10. Maybe they only have Recover now. It's Ludicolo all over again. It flinched. Crit. Flinch. Okay, I'm gonna heal. It does appear it only has recover. And if that is true, I'm gonna keep healing. Until it starts struggling. I do think it only has Restore left now. Yup. Now we wait it out. Four Citrus Berries left. Why did I think you beat the Peace Lock already? I don't know, because it's been five months? Hi, Cole Bobo. Can we get some yos? Hello. And I think there's two more Pokemon after this. <sighs> oh, it's struggling! <laughs> Only 10 damage. Imagine, imagine. Die. It flinched. But now I'm out of Leppa Berries. Or PP. Pee -pee. Guys, my feet are falling asleep. That only did 10. When my feet are falling asleep, it's so distracting. Only eight. Okay, I need to pause, my feet are asleep. Oh my God. This never happens. Nah, sometimes it does. I'm just sitting for three, four hours straight. Okay. It's clutch time, baby. My final citrus berry, Monka. No, I should save it. I'm gonna check my Pokemon summary to see if anybody else needs a level berry. Gyarados is good. Blossom is good. Blaziken is good. Oh, Ralph needs more Psychic. We'll give Ralph a level berry. And then we'll fight. Hmm. 
Let's try Ice Beam. Because if it freezes, that could be huge. It did not? <laughs> yeah, Bite does more damage. Now, is it late that I've gotten two Pokemon to start struggling? Be honest. Is that an honorable win? One thirty seven HP. I have to heal Gyarados before the next Pokemon. Now, if you still had your Electro type, it'd be lame. But it would be so much easier. Like, my speedrun would be ruined. My goal was to beat this in 125 hours. Which is still canon! Because 25 hours was my first save. So, technically, we're only at 107 hours, not 125. Or 132. Sag, my final suit. Or oh, wait, maybe I should do Parison Berry. What? Oh, wrong berry. Eh. Oran Berry. Oh, Struggle does 10 damage, though. Citrus Berry it is. My final Citrus Berry. Please, last two Pokemon be easy. Please! I should heal Blossom. Come on! Are you stalling for the next Pokemon? Yes. I'm just making sure as many of my Pokemon are as healed up as they can be. Because Milotic will die. Or maybe they won't. <laughs> Yeah, they're not dying. You know what? Which has the most... I haven't used Surf, let's use it now. Finally! How long did I take? Like, 20 minutes? <laughs> let's go! Milo Tick is dead. Two Pokemon left. Champion Wallace is about to use Wishcash. Wishcash is water, but they also have the ground-type move. Will I change? Yes. Wishcash might have a poison type. <sighs> I'm honestly surprised there's been no double battle so far. Wait. <laughs> I kind of want to put in Ralph, because Ralph can tank. Because Wishcash is either water, ground, or water, poison. So, you know what? Since Ralph has full health, they can tank. Let's put her in. Or put him in. I'm probably not getting legendaries. We might do it for sub only, though. Wait, does he have electricity? W for Wishcash. Oh, he's oblivious. He's Kalilis. Decent. He has a psychic type move. What? Shadow Ball. Two 
Turns out, he was ground type. Wait, I remember the last time we had Wishcast, he also did Earthquake, and I, like, was so shocked. Okay. Let's see. Hmm. Only problem is, I can keep Ralph in, but if it's an earthquake crit, I die. And you know what? I don't want to waste a turn. I'd rather get more damage on. Max Potion. Yes! He's gotta recharge, that means he misses a turn. Okay, I didn't think he'd use a restore there. I did not think that was a thing. Yeah, L for lame. Since this is the second to last Pokemon, I'm gonna heal Ralph to max. In case there's another Hypo Beam. Or Earthquake, that too. Okay, what does Amnesia do? Let's see. Special defense sharply rose. Oh, that's why my psychics aren't working. Oh. Maybe I should put a Magikarp here. Because Earthquake doesn't affect him. Let's see. It had Earthquake. It had Earthquake. Amnesia. I forgot the other move. How'd you beat Milo Tick? Struggling. It did not take an hour. I don't appreciate slander. Magikarp is going in. No way with Wish Cash can kill it, surely. Oh yeah, his attack falls. I forget about Magikarp. I forget. Oh, Hyper Beam. Oh, saved. Okay. Healing Ralph? <laughs> you think that'll work against me? <laughs> nice try. W. Oh, that was a crit? Sad. The first time Twister does a flinch. Wow. Awkward. It said it's special defense rose. I I don't know if bite is special. I think it is. Rip. And he flinched! <gasps> yes! Turn that W into an L. Wait, he's alive? What? No! <laughs> he should have died there. Bro! Now he's dead. Turn that W into an L. One more Pokemon left. Come on! Wait. 
What? Champion Wallace is about to use Gyarados. Will I change? I'm fixing it, I'm fixing it, I'm fixing it. You know, the stream is just like so hyped that it's causing everything to break. Oh wait, I forgot to put Drake on the board. Dude, if there's like a rival battle at the end of this, I'm gonna lose my fucking mind. Okay, back to work. Gyarados. You still have five Pokemon, it's Jilbert? No, it's not. It's literally not. Wait, you know what could go crazy? You know what could go crazy? We have Graveler in first. He dies. Right? And then the next turn we put a Pokemon in, because it has 250 power. Imagine it takes out the Gyarados, because it's a normal time move, it's not ground or anything. Wait, I kind of want to do it, it's the last Pokemon, guys. I would be down, what do you guys think? Because, realistically, for Gyarados, I know Gyarados' move type. It probably would not be smart to put in Ralph, because it could have Bite. Magikarp, it would be like... It would be a battle of attrition. And then Blossom is probably the safest pick. As long as it doesn't have Hydro Pump. Oh, wait, you're right. Wait. <laughs> but let's be honest. How funny would it be if we have Gavin just go in Purple Heart, you know? Because a lot of the gym leaders, they will do status moves first. A lot of them... In normal gyms, we'll do status move, not offensive. In the Elite Four, a lot have done offensive moves first. But I think, since it's a Gyarados, I think he's gonna open with Dragon Dance. So you know what? We ball. Graveler in first. Fuck it. Oh, he's only one level above me. Ooh, it does have Intimidate. Okay. Guys, everybody... Peace, I-2-7, Graveler. <laughs> okay, well, we tried. We tried. <laughs> okay. Dang it, if that would've worked... You know, if Gavin was faster, I think that could've worked. Well... I think we should do everybody but Gyarados last. So, Blossom, you're in. Dude, that was so funny. Poison could be crazy. There's been no status moves done. Let's try Solar Beam. Dragon Dance, their attack rose, and speed rose. Their evasiveness did not rose, so the solar beam might hit. Okay, that's good. I'm debating it if I want to do Solar Beam or Petal Dance. Because Solar Beam would take two turns. Because I assume since Gyarados the Dragon Dance twice is either going to hit in this turn or the next turn. But what if it has Hyper Beam too? But Hyper Beam is a grass type move. I don't think it would take off Blossom. I'm leaning more towards... Hyper Beam is normal? Wait, no. For Blossom, it's a Grass-type move. See? It's on screen. It 
If I do Petal Dance, it hits twice, so I assume he would heal the next turn. Oh, Hyper Beam and Solar Beam. Oh, wait. They're all the same kind. All the same kind. You know what, guys? I'm sorry. But, like, Twitch staff will get so mad at me if I don't run an ad right now. So, guys... If you don't want to miss a single second, don't worry. We're not going to beat this fight in one turn. So you'll be back from the ad in time. So, guys, click subscribe if you don't want to see the ads and you don't want to miss a single second. Five nine, yeah, five ninety nine, just six dollars. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long, or you can link your Amazon Prime to Twitch and subscribe for free. Ain't no way. Okay, I'm not nervous right now. I feel relatively confident because I have a lot of Pokemon left still. And by that, I mean four. I honestly think it would be better. Let me just see the accuracy for Blossom's moves again. Poison. Sleep powder. Yeah, I was thinking the sleep powder, to be honest. Because the sleep powder would make it so they can't move that turn. But this Gyarados is faster than me. Poison powder would cause it to have damage. I'm kind of down. Because, like I said, if I do Petal Dance or Solar Beam, he's for sure gonna heal. So I kind of want to put it to sleep first if I can. Oh. Okay, cool. Ground is not effective against grass. <gasps> it worked! I've never used the powders, and it worked for once! Oh my god, oh my god! Now we do Petal Dance. Watch and learn, boys! He's still asleep. He's not healing! <gasps> oh my god. I told you that philosophy was great! Yes! Bo Gyarados fainted. Ooh, gained 2,568 experience points. You defeated... Champion Wallace. After three hours. Almost exactly three hours. I, the champion, fall in defeat. That was wonderful work. You were elegant. Infuriatingly so. And yet, it was utterly glorious. Kudos to you, Peason. You are truly... You are a truly noble Pokemon trainer. You got 11,600 Poke Dollars for winning. The Pokemon you sent into battle... At times, they dance like spring breeze. Sorry, I forgot the A. At times, they dance like a spring breeze, and at times, they struck the lightning. It was with light, yet sure-footed elegance that you led your Pokémon. Even I felt bedazzled by your masterful performance. You now stand at the glorious peak of the Pokémon League. I now proclaim you to be the no Hoenn region. I'm going to flip my shit! <laughs> Peace in. How would you like some advice before you challenge the champion? Peason? Are you trying to tell me you've beaten the champion already? Oh, okay, I, I don't think I have to battle him. See, what did I tell you, Brandon? Didn't I tell you that you don't need to worry about Peason? Peason, you finally done it. When I heard that you defeated your own father at the Petalburg Gym, I thought perhaps you had a chance. But to think you've actually become the champion. Guys, you were here, you were here. Ah, uh, yes. What became of your Pokedex? Here, let me see. Hmm. So you've seen 154 Pokemon and you've caught 94. Have you visited the Safari Zone? I hear there are some Pokemon that can be only caught there. Anyways, congratulations. Now go proudly into the final room. Peason. No, let me rephrase that properly. The new champion. Come with me. I'm sorry, but... From here on, only those trainers who have become champions may enter. We have to wait outside. You'll have to wait outside with Professor Birch. What? It can't be helped if that's the rule. P 
piece, and way to go! Congratulations! This room. This is where we keep records of Pokémon that prevailed through harsh battles. It is here that the League Champions are honored. Come on, let's record your name. Come on, let's record your name as a trainer who triumphed over the Pokémon League, and the names of the partners who battled with you. Auto saves? What if I want to go back and do it again? Oh my god! Oh, this is so cool. I'm gonna cry. Graveler, you died. I'm sorry. Blossom honestly came in clutch. Oh my god. Manectric, I'm so sorry, but let's be honest, the final fight was definitely more epic. Okay, guys, officially, the peace lock is done. Wait, I wanted to screenshot. Dang it. <laughs> Let's go! Screenshot! There we go, finally! 107 hours! Let's go! Finally! Did I beat it on the first try? I didn't even need to reset! You know what I did? After three hours... I beat the Elite Four all on my own. I'll say it. Screw the doubters. And I know one of you suckers lost 20k points, and I'm happy for that. Whew. After five long months, over 24 streams, the Peace Lock is officially done. I am never playing Pokemon again until next March. We'll do this every year. Different Nuzlocke, different game every year. If you liked it, follow right now. If you liked it, subscribe right now. If you liked it, give subs right now. Okay, I'm done. Oh my god! Guys, you were here. I'm so relieved. Okay. After how many resets? Three resets, one reset being... The fighting gym, the second being I lost my save. Wait, no, the third reset was I lost my save. I don't remember what the second reset was. Oh, wait, because I, I, I died Torchic to the first trainer battle. That was it. Man, I was so scared I would have to reset after the Elite Four. But you know what? I did it. If I were to do it again, I'm buying 50 of every heal. Fuck it. Okay, we're done. Let's see what the end game is like. Holy moly. All oh, the credits. Guys, you were here. You were here. Wallace is on the board now. Finally. Lush Ralph. Man, remember when my Zigzagoon died? Genuinely, there were so many times when this run almost ended. Remember the Manectric we ran into when I only had, like, Gyarados? I had Gyarados and then four Ghost and Dark-type Pokemon, and I lost, like, half the team there. Whew. It's so pretty. The sunset? You have to release your Manectric for the run to count? Yeah, we'll do that at the end. But I- the- street- I beat it when I beat the game. Look, the credits are on screen, bozo! It's the thing at the top? Yeah, see? Oh. Brendan? This is so cute. Wait, somebody got auto-modded? Who said a slur? <laughs> somebody said a very bad word. Holy... We 
Wait, do you guys remember when my Kabuto died? Man, so much happened in the peace lock. I feel so bad for the future editor, which is probably gonna be me. Oh, they're so cute. Ain't no way! Thank you for the 200 bits, Electra. Can we get some... Weathers in chat? Thank you, Electra. I hope you enjoyed the peace lock. Oh my god, I'm so- I'm so relieved. I prolonged finishing this run because I deadass thought I would lose. And I'm so happy that I did it. The end. <sighs> Crazy that I've been here the whole time, dude. I know. I know. Let's see. The end. I'm pressing A on my totally real GBA. That's not paper. Holy shit. On to Gen 4, maybe next year. I don't want to play Pokemon. Wait, I just realized now that we beat Pokemon, we can play Pokerog. Oh my god, finally. I have been waiting forever to play Pokerog. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Should we do it tomorrow? Fuck it. One last time for nostalgia's sake. Oh, Sag Torchic. Man. Pokemon Emerald. I'll say it, my favorite Pokemon game of all time. I think I would have enjoyed it a lot more if it wasn't a Nuzlocke, but still. I think it was the right amount of challenging, because let's be honest, new Pokemon games are baby games. Whew. There we go. That is Pokemon Emerald, everybody. 132 hours, 33 minutes, 51 seconds. For this entire attempt, it took 107 hours. For this run... Wait, I gotta look. This is for the YouTube frogs. Guys, type you were here, you were here. That way we get more YouTube frogs to watch live. For this run, I released 14 Pokemon. Three resets, one of which being I lost my save. The Pokemon I lost was Whirlpool, due to chat. Zigzagoon, because I fainted, it was the Manetric fight. Winkle, I lost Wingle somehow. Lotad, I lost Wingle. Meryl, oh, we lost Meryl? I think it was in the fighting gym. Mary! Wait, my grandma's name is Mary, she died. Anyway. Slackoff, chat killed. I could have had a slacking. I remember it was specifically vacanted in chat. Abra. I lost Abra in a gym. Geodude fainted somehow. Oh yeah, Geodude was my first Graveler. <gasps> so- I forgot about the Solos. I lost Magneton. Or Magnemite. One of the two somehow in a fight. It was a gym fight. I lost Absol. Manetric fight. I lost Shuppet. Manetric fight. Chat made me kill Vulpix. I remember that was you, Alex. I remember it. And then finally, I lost Bayonetta due to chat. The peace lock is finally over. It's Jover. Now, we can, like, do other shit on stream. <laughs> Once again, I would like to thank you all for watching. If you didn't watch me play games live, you can follow my Twitch, twitch.tv slash peace and underscore 17. It's honestly a wild ride here when you watch live. And like, as you saw with these videos, you can like interact and make me kill my Pokemon. Um, just end off. I would like to thank everybody for watching, whether you watched live or if you're watching the highlights later. Honestly, this was my first time ever playing a real Pokemon game. And it was hard. And I appreciate most everybody who watched live who avoided Baxi Gaming. That way I can learn. Yes, I did ask for help sometimes. But thank you guys for respecting it for the most part. Next year, I promise... It will not take 132 hours. It will not. It will not. Everybody, that was the peace lock. Thank you for watching. Yeah, no resets in the final Elite Four. Okay. Guys, I'm done.
I'm fucking done. Man, I feel so good right now. I think I need to take this coat off. It's too hot. Nah, the stream is almost over. I'll leave it on. Well, guys, the stream went longer than I thought it would. It took me an hour to get ready and then three hours for the actual fight. It could have gotten done quicker, but, you know, oh well. So, yeah. We did get a donation. So, we do get to do calligraphy. You guys know the drill. Use your channel points or donate to the channel and I'll write your name. But before we get that set up, just a gentle reminder. If you aren't already, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel, Weekly Stream Highlights. It's free to subscribe over there. It's not six bucks. Okay, the command's not working. It's youtube.com slash... Wait, YouTube... I spelled it wrong. YouTube.com slash at peason17. Click the link. Go subscribe. It's free to subscribe over there. And the newest YouTube video is the chest highlight. Banger video. I promise you'll chuckle and troll and laugh. Okay. Let's go. Let's turn this stupid game off. Wait, should we see what the end game is? Peace and lied, people cried. I, we didn't see what the end game was. Oh, we're back home. Wait, should I? I think there's like a cutscene or something, right? Guys, back to Pokemon. Peace and lied, people cried. I mean, there's a lot of endgame stuff. I did get spoiled a little bit. There's like a cutscene with the mom, right? Peace and light, people cried. Go to Rayquaza? No, I, I'm literally sweating my ass off. Okay, well, we spawned when I reopened the game in home. Am I on the TV? In search of trainers. Gabby. Hi, today I'm visiting an area near Route 120. We're trying to spot some up-and-coming new talent in the field. Today, we turned our lens on the trainer, Peason. There's something about this trainer that piqued our interest. We battled Peason before, but we can attest that the trainer has most definitely improved from before. Wait, that's so real. I knew we were onto something special when we spotted this trainer. The best way to determine how strong a trainer is, well, the fastest way is to battle. And so we begin our investigation. That's how we ended up in battle with Peason. In a dominating performance, we were flattened, rolled up, and tossed aside. Peason is ruthlessly... Peason is ruthlessly strong. Here's our impressions after having battled our feature trainer. The combination of Gardevoir and Blaziken was divine. The sight of them, Gardevoir and Blaziken selflessly supporting each other in the thick of battle. It was a marvelous sight to behold. Double Kick was the move the trainer used last in our battle. The move Double Kick is Gardevoir and Blaziken's sign of friendship. After our battle, we asked Peason for a... Sustenance summary. The trainer replied, confused. Galulus. Peason's Pokemon Gardevoir and Blaziken and confused. Hmm, that's deep. There's deep significance behind that quote. It's no surprise. A good trainer has good things to say. That's all for today. See you again on our next broadcast. They kick each other more like kiss each other. Okay, let's go downstairs. Father? Did you come back with the milk? Hmm. Hey, it's Peason. It's been a while since I saw you, but you look stronger somehow. That's the impression I get. But your old man hasn't given up yet. Oh yes, I have something for you. This came for you... Oh yes, I have something for you. This came for you from someone named Mr. Briny. You obtained the SS ticket. <gasps> we can go on a cruise, guys. Be honest, would you cancel me if I went on a cruise? It's okay, you can be honest. Because, like, there are some cruise lines that go from Seattle along the west coast, and they sound pretty pog. Hmm. A ticket for a ferry. If I recall, there are a few ferry ports in Slateport and Lily Cove. I'd better get back to Petalburg Gym. Oh, wait, that's father. <laughs> I'd better get back to Petalburg Gym. Mom, thanks for looking after the house while I'm away. Wait, did you see her dad's, like, balding hairline? <laughs> Bald is beautiful, guys. That dad of yours. He comes home for the first time in a while, but all he talks about is Pokemon. You should relax and stay a little longer. She's like, I haven't gone to action in months. Is that a breaking news story? We bring you this emergency news flash. In various home, in various home locales, there have been reports of a 
colored Pokemon in flight. The identify the identity of this Pokemon is currently unknown. We now return you to the regular movie program. Kaysen, did you catch that? What color did the announcer say that Pokemon was? Uh, he said bzz, so I guess blue is closest. Well, isn't that something? There are still unknown Pokemon. Oh, hello. Professor Birch. Well, well, Peason. That was good work out there. I know there was something special about you when I first saw you, but I never expected this. Oh yes, do you still have the Pokedex I gave you? I have something to show you. Let's go to my lab. Now? Peason and Brendan, I have... What? Peason and Brendan, I've had the two of you help me study Pokemon. Thanks to your help, new facts are coming to light. It appears that in the Hoenn region, there are also Pokemon from other regions. He goes to show how rich and varied the natural environments of Hoenn happen to be. That's why I think it's necessary for me to upgrade your Pokedex to the national mode. Here, let me see your Pokedex units. Do we get to trade now? I went out all over Hoenn and checked out Pokemon. You can thank me for getting the national mode Pokedex. Yep, you're lucky, Peason. Okay, all done. Peason's Pokedex- oh. Peason's Pokedex was upgraded to the national mode. But listen, you have become the champion, but your Pokemon journey isn't over. There is no end to the road that is Pokemon. Somewhere there is a grassy patch that's waiting for you. Okay, well, I assume- oh no. Beep. It's Scott. Hi hi, Peason, it's me, Scott. I'm aboard the SS title now, it feels great to be on the sea. By the way, there's this place that I'd like to invite you for a visit. If you're interested, board a ferry at either Slateport or Lily Cove. I'll fill you in on the details when we meet. I'll be waiting. Click. Okay, so I assume that just sets up, like, the endgame missions, which we'll do another time. Bonus episode, but for now, let's save... Okay, now officially, we're done for today. But, uh, editor, you'll have to cut the endgame VOD from today, and then the next time we play Pokemon. Finally, it's over! Okay, now we can do calligraphy. I'm really tired and I'm hungry. Splice time? No, I don't- I don't think we're gonna keep the live split from when we do endgame stuff. The live split was only for the P-slot part. I'm sorry, speedrunning fans. Wait, this looks so crazy on camera. Look at that. Guys, nominate Peason for Hidden Gem for the 2024 Stream Awards, and I'll wear this- I'll wear this there. Okay. Let's close this out. Oh my god. Where's the poll? Oh. Uh, Cutie Cinderella said the voting starts, like, later this year. You tell us to vote, but not where? Um, it's not open yet, but I'm just- I'm planting seeds. I'm doing master manipulation. That way, whenever the stream reward voting opens, it'll already, like, be in the back of your mind. Guys, vote peace and vote peace and vote peace and vote peace and. Or peace and underscore 17. That way they can, like, find my channel. Okay. Is the music playing? There we go. There's the music. Okay. You know the drill. Use your channel points or subscribe and I'll write your name. Also, shout out to everybody who watched the entire stream today. I know it was a long one. It went longer than I thought. But you know what? W. I am still really happy I beat it on the first try. Who was the other doubter? It was Ethan, right? I know, Alex, you gambled 20k like a, a goof. But I think it was also Ethan. Okay, I gotta plug the second camera in. Look at this. If I lose the 10 more pounds, look at that. It'll fit. I said this yesterday, but my goal was to lose 20 pounds by the end of the year. I'm already down 15. W. Oh, okay.
while I'm getting this set up, just a gentle reminder, I will be doing the subathon starting on Thursday for my three-year stream anniversary. Three years of peace in, guys. So if you have any ideas for activities, there's a post on my Twitter. And also, we're doing custom India ink portraits of viewers. So if you want your portrait drawn for free, <laughs> um, post a picture of yourself on that separate Twitter post I made. And if we get no submissions, we're not doing it. I'm almost done plugging in the camera. Plugging in this camera is so annoying. Um, this is the Sony ZV-E10. In order to enable the USB compatibility, you have to turn a setting on and you can't leave it plugged in. It's so annoying. Okay, let's see if she works. Oh my god, there's two of me. There it is. I also need to color correct it now because I did do some manual color settings. That's a little better. Also, mods change the category. Dude, I'm genuinely so happy I beat it today. Because, like, imagine if I didn't beat it by the end of the month again. I'm talking about the end of the month. If you want a custom portrait sketch card drawn that I'll mail to you, give five subs by tomorrow. Or, honestly, I'd prefer if you wait till Thursday, because... Subathon? <laughs> Guys, I need to buy the plane ticket soon. And then, what else? What should we do tomorrow? I'm debating on what I want to do. I either want to do... Because we, we need, like, streams for YouTube videos. Tomorrow? I was either thinking Super Auto Pets. Stream ends when I get a win. A win being 10 trophies. I've been practicing Super Auto Pets. And the fastest I got a win was 20 minutes. And then also, we can either do Poker Rogue. And then Poker Rogue is stream it no we're not we're not doing that tomorrow if i do poker rogue we'll do two separate streams one will be stream ends when i die which it could be a five minute stream and i think that's really fucking funny and then another day we can do stream ends when i beat it but that let's be honest is going to be like an eight hour stream <laughs> I, I i don't think we'll do poker rogue tomorrow we can maybe do it next next week so tomorrow I, what do you guys think do you guys want to do cooking mama or Super Auto Pets. Because those will both be YouTube edits for the main channel. Think and ponder. What do you want? Oh my god, Mario Kart. Should we do another stream when I get first to Mario Kart? That was honestly one of my favorite streams from last year. Eight hours, that's fast. Yeah, that's why I'm like... The Poker Rogue stream is when I beat Poker Rogue is probably going to be like a subathon in itself. I've only beaten it once by save scamming. I will not do that. Smile. <laughs> also, before anybody tries to cop my username, I already have it on Poker Rogue. And also, I don't know if I want to do Dress to Impress for the subathon. Because, like, everybody's playing it, and, like, I'm an indie streamer. I don't like playing mainstream games. Dress to impress IRL. That would be the funniest shit. How much would that even cost to produce? Probably, like, a few thousand. Guys, subathon <laughs> for dress to impress. Oh, wait, I'm so tired. I also got a new brand of protein shake this morning from the shop, and it was delicioso. Como se dice... Oh, tengo hambre. I'm hungry. What am I gonna do with my GBA now? Guys, it was fake this whole time. 
I'm sorry for lying. Ain't no way my orange pin is dying. By WarioWare? I'm never playing WarioWare on stream because so many of the motion controls are, like, inappropriate. And you honestly requesting it is such a red flag. Mods put that on their records, their permanent record. Dude, I cannot wait till Christmas. The Christmas streams are so fun. Get the GBA version? Oh, you're right. Not saying that, like, I would, you know, go plundering and pirating games, but... Now that we know that Mr. Nintendo doesn't care if I do the peace lock on my GBA, maybe we'll do more older games. I still want to save Wii games for every January for Wii Week. I think that makes sense. Because, like, I, I don't want to be, like, a retro gamer. Because then everybody's gonna, like... I, I don't want boomers watching. Also, once again, thank you to Electra for the 200 bitch here. Plus two! Wait, guys, I'm actually so close to my Twitch payout. I'm, like, $2 away. I was $4 away, now I'm $2 away. Okay. Once again, thank you, Electra, for the 200 bits. I hope you enjoy the peace lock. And I hope... I hope... <laughs> Because I know Electra says they watch on their TV. <laughs> I hope my yelling didn't scare the people in the house. Where to donate? Oh. I take Gesha, but it doesn't count towards switching from. Honestly, sitting and watching the ads is a dub. And if you're a Twitch Turbo sub, that also gives me revenue too. But like by that, I I, I cannot say my rev split. But let me just say, all the ad revenue I get for an entire calendar year is barely enough to buy a 6-inch from Subway. And 6-inch subs in my area are $8. I'm not explicitly saying my rev split Twitch, I'm just I'm making a comparison. That's an expensive sub? No, for real! Anybody remember when subs were $5? Like, it's something really funny. When... I used to work at Subway, right? And when I worked there, that was when they were first phasing out the $5 footlongs. And so many people got so angry that we no longer offer their promotion. But I'll say it. If you're still a sucker who goes to Subway and pays like $16 to $20 for a footlong, you deserve to get scammed. I'm sorry, I'm saying it. You can get cheaper sandwiches from other places. Yeah, you may like the flavor of Subway. And Okay, Subway isn't necessarily super healthy either. Their market is like a fresh alternative to fast food. But Subway products, like both the meats and the breads, have a lot of sodium and they have a lot of sugar. They're not super healthy to eat like every day or multiple times a week. If you're able to cook for yourself, make food at home. But if you're not... Subway, if you want to get Subway and you want, like, something healthier, get a salad. And tell them to not chop it too much. I only like their cookies. Their cookies are amazing. No, have you guys seen the footlong cookie? I really want to get it. I really do. But do I, do I really need a footlong cookie? Not me eating Subway yesterday. Caught, caught. I'll be honest, every shift that I worked at Subway, obviously different franchises have different perks and roles, but every single shift, you could get a free six inch and then a free cookie. So I typically did opening shifts. So I would always bake myself an extra cookie. That way I could have the freshest cookie. And dude, it's so good. Subway cookies are so good. But let me just say, if you go to a Subway and you see that their case is filled, with like 20 to 30 cookies for every flavor those are like three days old 
the reason why they have to cook that much is because sometimes they get last minute catering orders and now that they offer the cookie bag they have to have that many on standby but not many people buy the cookie tote or the cookie bag so all the cookies you're seeing in the case are old they're old a foot long to celebrate the 20 pound loss but subway is so expensive and like i'll have an llc yet for stream so it's not a tax write-off wait we do that on the art stream w okay guys last call anybody else want their name written i'm very tired i'm not gonna stall any longer wait i just realized i have to cook tonight no no how much for a subway cookie last time i was there which was Oh my god, I quit my job three years ago. Shit. Three years ago, a cookie was... Um, I think a dollar twenty... No. I think they were 99 cents and then two for a dollar fifty. Obviously, they're up now. Okay, guys, we're done. We're done. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'm honestly so happy, so relieved... You know what's funny? This is all the live splits for the peace lock throughout the run. I'm going to write the final split. 132, 33, 51, 0. 0.69. Yeah, these are all the live splits and other notes and crossed out things, but... There we go. Over 24 streams, I think, because we did streams offline for the berry harvesting, which is honestly a dub. Having all those citrus berries did help a lot. We'll have to go back and look at the VOD channel, but I think it was a total of like 27 streams. 132 hours, the peace lock is done. Now we never talk about it again. We, we just... I'm no longer a Pokemon streamer. Okay, guys. I'm tired. I'm gonna go eat. I also have to make dinner. Shit. I did go grocery shopping this morning, so we're probably having salmon tonight. And I got avocados. When will I play the end game? Okay. Uh, we'll probably. I don't know. Maybe in like two weeks, because there's other streams that I want to do in the upcoming weeks. Because the theme for August in general, similar theme to the subathon, is nostalgia. So playing games that I used to play on stream and like beating them. And then the theme for September. Now you guys cannot leak. No leakers. If you watch to the end, this is our little secret. And no, I'm not going to share it in Twitch Whispers. Not like that. The theme for September. Shape up September. I'm not going to say this again. So September will be fitness games. And I wanted to do that theme in September because obviously the the alliteration, the S, 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 S. And also, it's three quarters of the way through the year so we can follow up on my resolution to lose 20 pounds, which I'm already at 15. So for Shape Up September, we're going to be doing a lot of fitness Switch games, fitness Wii games. If I can get the Wii Fit board to work, then I'll have to leak my weight on stream. <laughs> so maybe I don't want to get it working. <laughs> But yeah, that's, that's September. And then August is random games. Random just chatting streams because we need more YouTube content. And then nostalgia. That's the plan for the next two months. And then obviously October is Halloween. November is Thanksgiving. So maybe we'll bring back cooking streams. And December is Christmas. We basically have the whole year planned out. By we, I mean me. So yeah, the plan is simple. Okay, guys. Sub to the YouTube, please. I need clout. And if you like the stream, you'll like the highlights. It's like the stream, but better. Okay, I'll see you guys later. Once again, thank you. Thank you to... Oh, I didn't change the scene. Wait, we we need the Pokemon ending screen for one last time. There we go. Once again, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I don't know what time. It'll either be Super Auto Pets or um Cookie Mama. Honestly, it depends on how I feel. But thank you for watching. And once again, thank you to Electra for the 200 bits. Thank you! Plus two! Okay. I'm playing the outro song right away because I'm really tired. And I'm hungry. Any last words?
VOD watchers pretend is like the outro to my YouTube videos. Wait, is anybody live? I don't. Rainy hasn't streamed in a while. Uh, nobody's live. Awkward. Oh yeah, Scootish's subathon ended last night. Sag, no more twenty-four hour stream. Dude, I'm like so lean back in my chair. Bye, Tooth. Bye, Alex. Bye, Electra. Also, I'm happy to see you today, Alex. We haven't seen you in chat in a while. Man, finally it's over. No more stupid Pokemon. Wait, is the song over? Oh, it's almost over. You guys got 20 more seconds. Okay. I'll see you guys tomorrow.